Oh, Hachi! <laughs> oh, Hachi, everybody! Oh my gosh. Feels like it's it's been a while since I've said Oh, Hachi. <laughs> Welcome in, everybody. Welcome in. Yeah, I'm Freya. <laughs> I'm not doing face cam today. Yes, of <laughs> Um, well, I'm just using Freya as a... as a representation. I'm not gonna be role-playing as Freya today. I mean, I will be... voice acting the game, but... <laughs> ohachi, ohachi! Good to see you guys! Also, what the heck? <laughs> um, I forgot that I even had... I forgot that I even had monetization on on YouTube. <laughs> so thank you so much, Hidden Men, for the Aka Supa before the stream even properly started. Oh my goodness. <laughs> thank you so much, Hidden Men. Big love to you. <laughs> yeah, so I am just really, really happy to see you guys today. It has been it has been a while. I mean we had my um we had my birthday stream, but also I was like, super sick at the time. <laughs> so I can finally go... Burr, 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 burr. Thank you so much, Athesis, for subscribing. Burr, 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 burr. Welcome to the beehive. <laughs> welcome in, welcome in. Oh, this is a little... It's a little overwhelming, too, because I'm restreaming... Or I'm using restream to co-stream for the very first time on both YouTube and Twitch. So, um, I guess I'll do a little bit of introductions. Wow! Wow! <laughs> Wait, this is wild. <laughs> it says, thank you so much for the pink sofa. That means a lot to me. Wow, your first, your first, first sofa here. Wow, wow. <laughs> and thank you so much, Cat, as well. Watching Freya romance Freya. Yes, that's that's precisely what we're gonna be doing today. <laughs> thank you so much for coming in, you guys. Thank you. Yes, I did indeed do a voice in the game, which is why. Don't mind your profile picture, I can explain. Um... So to be honest, I, I can't even see... Your profile picture right now. Because, uh, the restream... Chat... It shows, like, my combined YouTube and Twitch chats, but it doesn't show people's profile pictures since there's no profile... No, wait, there are profile pictures on Twitch. So I don't know. <laughs> um... Amba, you're here too! Hello, Amba! Everybody, please give lots of love to Amba as well, who did a voice of a character. A secret character who we will come across eventually in the game. Um, so thank you so much for being here. I see so many wonderful, wonderful people. You chose Freya in the game too? Wow, thank you so much, Elika. Thank you. Yeah, so so um there are lots of familiar faces here that I'm very happy to see. Hi, Serena. Hi, Zeta, Katernal, Aqua, Hidden Men, Comfy. Um Tempest, just so many, so many beehive friends, but also lots of new faces, lots of new faces. Cat, Anva, Nathan, um, you know, Athesis. Um, oh my gosh, hi Pixie Vote, hi Mictel, hi friends, hi Nectarines, Mori, oh my goodness, so many of you. Miss Bo, oh my gosh, it has been a while. So don't mala. Tachikoma, how have you guys been? DJ and Natural, I know that you brought along your, your friend as well. I know you brought around, along your friend too. Hi, Goin! Hello, hello. Good to see you guys. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much for the for the subs as well. Thank you so much. I'm hidden in. Nectarines, Athesis, Millennia. Big love to you all. Well, thank you for the raid too. Moro ni ni ni. Welcome in, welcome in. Ah, Shinna, thank you for the follow. Oh my goodness. I will do my very, very best to thank all of you guys that were able to come in. Hi, Cyberpunk, how you doing? Welcome in, welcome in. Hi, Nemo Nemo. Um, it's a, it's a horror game, but it is also very... I mean, it's not extremely scary. It's... it just has the spooky vibes. I think if I can handle it, you can definitely handle it. Oh, thank you so much, Moto. It means a lot to me. It means a lot. Um, some of you guys may be a little confused about me responding to messages that you might not see specifically in chat. It is because I am streaming on both YouTube and Twitch. But, um, you can hopefully see some of the combined messages on the screen here. 
For those of you guys that are new, I am so happy to introduce myself. Hello? Or Ohachi, as we say at the Phoebe Hive. I am Phoebe. I'm your 2.5D fairy tale idol. Here to inspire you to write your own story, because you're a very, very special part of my own story. I have been writing my own songs in both Japanese and in English for the past couple of years and performing them on both the real life and the virtual stage. Though this year, I went on my very, very first national US tour, released my very first original album, All of My Life, which would make me really happy if you guys checked it out. There should be a link down below in the description. And I took a little bit of a break from VTubing as Phoebe so that I could focus more on, you know, my tour, as well as cool stuff like voice acting and auditioning for projects and finally getting to see a project that I recorded for release. Ta-da! Little goody two shoes! <laughs> I... it's... I am so... so heckin' grateful for this opportunity. It really was a dream come true. I've been a big fan of the studio Astral Shift Pro for many, many years, ever since they released Pocket Mirror. And so it was a dream come true when I found out that Kira, the um, art director, um, one of the producers on the project, um, specifically wanted to invite me to voice act for the game. And I didn't know which character I was going to be. I knew what characters there were because they had been releasing previews on their Patreon and on their social media for a while. And I was like, wow, they're all super duper cute. I wonder who it's going to be. And I knew that my senpai, Diana Garnett, was going to be the voice of the main character, Elise. And it had been a dream of mine to uh, voice with her officially in a project for a long time. So I knew it wasn't going to be Elise. And so I was like, I wonder who it's going to be. Um, I thought it was going to be Rose and Marine, actually. And a lot of you guys playing the demo thought that I voiced Rose and Marine at first. <laughs> um, but when I saw Freya's design in particular, and I read about her personality and stuff, I was like, wow, I really hope it's Freya. And then, lo and behold, it was Freya. So, I... <laughs> yeah, Diana Garnett is actually um, my mentor when it comes to singing and voice acting, and she's been my teacher for many years. And so, it is just a stroke of good luck and fate that we ended up on this project together. And I am very, very grateful. Um, because of time restraints, they weren't able to get Freya and Leb Kluhan's character songs out. But, I'm hoping to, uh, work with Oka, or maybe some of the other composers for Little Goody Two Shoes, on a Freya character song to be, to be released separately from the game later on. So please, please do look forward to that. Please look forward to that. And I don't know, maybe I'll make some other Little Goody Two Shoes, uh, covers as well. So, I'll look forward to that on YouTube, hopefully. <laughs> ah, hi, Kiana! Good to see you! <laughs> So many friendos are here, so many friendos. I think your voice fit Freya really well, TBH. So good job on that. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. And yes, called Diana Garnett, the the singer. Mm -hmm. Um, I just hope that if there's a sequel, it's called Little Goody Three Shoes. <laughs> well, well, there it actually is a prequel to their old game, Pocket Mirror. So you can go ahead and check out Pocket Mirror after you um, play through Little Goody Two Shoes. Little Goody Two Shoes led me here, still in my first playthrough, and I already love it so much. I am so happy to hear that. I'm really, really happy to hear that. So, uh, I'm personally really, really excited to play the game myself for the very first time with you guys. I've had a copy of the game, thanks to Astral Shift and Square Enix Collective, since pre-release, but I've been saving it to play with you guys on stream for a while. So, I'm really, really, really excited. <laughs> I've been looking forward to this for a while. Um, yeah, I'm so disciplined. Right, right? Thank you, yes. Praise me more. Be proud of me. Be proud of me. <laughs> uh, she does sound amazing. I would love to... I would love to create a Freya character song. So I'm going to be working really hard on co-writing that um, with one of the composers from the game. 
Hopefully, Oka, who's, who's been a dream composer of mine to work with. But all the composers were amazing. And, um... In the meantime, I would say that if any of my original songs that are released so far would be a Freya character song, it would be Fairy Tale. So I recommend you go and listen to Fairy Tale and watch the music video on my YouTube channel if you haven't yet done so. Mm -hmm. Oh, thank you, Miktel, thank you. This is a... It is... It does feel very special, Arima, it does. I can't wait to make some happy memories with you guys playing this game. And, uh, hopefully not some frightening memories. Eto, let's go ahead and get started, shall we? Boo -boo -boo. There we go... Hold on, I'm just waiting for the game to load up. So how is it like having me co-stream on YouTube and on Twitch? Would you prefer that I kept it in one place? I kind of want to start doing stuff on my YouTube channel more, just to keep everything in one place. I like the way that YouTube archives things a little better than Twitch. But then, like, we're a Twitch partner, and we worked really hard, and we have all those emotes and animated emotes and stuff. Yeah, it feels pretty seamless, right? Right? Come on, game. You can do it. You can do it, game. I... Aha! Here we are. So I think... What the? Okay. I'm gonna go with... Classic controls, probably, just because that's what I'm used to for RPG Maker games. Twitch controls are kinda janky, YouTube is smoother. Yeah, I mean, there's some reasons why I like Twitch, and there's some reasons why I like YouTube. Okay, so this is the difficult part. This is the very difficult part, and I think I'm going to try running a poll on both... ...YouTube and on Twitch right now, to see what you guys would prefer... ...for language. So let's go ahead and do a poll together. Which language... How do I spell? Language! <laughs> English... Japanese... Right? So there's the YouTube poll. Go ahead and vote on that, and then... Twitch! <laughs> ah. Oh, it's multitasking hard. Multitasking difficult. Flash. Oh. oh. Oh, thank you! Oh, you got it! Thank you, Joga! Bless you, bless you! Okay. Oh my gosh, how am I gonna add this up? Twitch and YouTube are, are so split right now. What the heck? Okay, I'm just gonna... <laughs> ah! <laughs> uh, hi, King Cobra! I'm so happy to see you! Also, hi, Aramis! Hello, cat! How you doing? Amaranth, I'm so happy to see you here! Oh my god. Okay, um. Twitch is 59% English. YouTube is 50% English, 50% Japanese. Oh, actually, the turns are starting to table. The turns are tabling right now. How the turns have tabled. Okay, it looks like English is probably. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Okay, I bet some of you guys are going back and forth between. The link. Yes, so, so the thing is that I do both English and Japanese voices, so you're gonna get to hear me no matter what. And the cast is exactly the same. It is one-to-one -one between the English and the Japanese versions. Which is extremely, extremely ambitious and rare, so props to all the actors and stuff. Hold on, let me... Oh my gosh, let me fix this... this chat thing. Show. Yeah, for every character. Every single character. Mm-hmm, I've never seen a game do that either. Mm hmm. Hi. So I'm ending the poll. On YouTube, it was 61% English. On Twitch, it is 63% English, which is pretty much the same. So we are going to be playing it in English. You're playing it in Japanese, so I wouldn't mind hearing the English. Ah, okay, that's perfect then. That is perfect. I like how Japanese is the first choice. <sighs> Opening song! <laughs> I 
Everything about this game is so beautiful. Honestly, I would too, Cyberpunk. You can't skip the OP. Designs are gorgeous, and the music's gorgeous. How is it possible to be such a fanboy of your own project? Like I am just such, I am such, ugh, I am such a fanboy. Oh my gosh! Hi. Once upon a time, there was a girl who loved books. Little Goody Two Shoes. Welcome, everybody! Little Goody Two Shoes. Little Goody Two Shoes! Oh, yeah, I have to start thinking about what kind of voices I'm gonna do for each of the characters. Mm. Well, think of it like a chef. Are they not allowed to enjoy the food they make? That is true, Joga. That is true. You know, we can be proud of the things that we make. Phoebe is my favorite two shoes. <laughs> Both shoes. Get you, get yourself get yourself a girl that can do both shoes. Hi. Phoebe is a huge nerd affectionate. Oh, th thank you. This is like the start of my fairy tale music video. Now why would I skip the cinematic? Once upon a time, in the heart of a remote valley. An elderly woman ventured deep into the woods in search for mushrooms. There do be the shrooms, when all of a sudden she heard a loud cry in the distance. <laughs> My goodness! <laughs> Cradles inside a rope basket was a cheerful baby girl. Baby! Oh my, what do I do? Worry not, my dear. I'll name you... Elise. And so, Paul and Elise spent their days together in the village of Kieferber. <laughs> Cute little gremlin! <laughs> As both grew closer, so did their love for one another. Wholesome. <laughs> look, Granny, look! <laughs> well done, Elise. <laughs> Not all bliss lasts forever, and as time went by... <laughs> uh, oh, it's so wholesome! So baby! Mud soup, the best. Delicious, especially if there's bugs in it. So did Halls. Oh, I'll take care of you! I'll do whatever it takes, Granny! Don't cry, my love. You've always said you wanted it. I'm sure you'll cherish it. <laughs> Granny! I love you, Elise. Oh man, no. I'm not supposed to cry already. We're not even... We haven't even started the gameplay yet. Thank you for granting my only wish. <sighs> Granny? Granny? Oh, Granny! 
For goodness sake. There goes my last match. For goodness sake. I can't do it like Diana though, she's so good. For goodness sake. <laughs> oh, I'm so tired of this place. Wash my sheets, Elise. Sweep my floors, Elise. Elise, Elise, Elise! Oh, I'd show them. I'd make them scrub my pots and pans. My shoes, even. Have them wipe down all my windows. Every last one, your little goody two shoes. <laughs> Clean out my hearth and fetch me some water. Better yet, I'd have them running around calling me Miss Elise all day. Also, thank you, Sharks, for the sub. Thank you. Oh, if only I were rich. I, I, I say that every day. <laughs> All the steak I could ever want. All the shiny dresses. One for each day of the week with shoes and jewels to match. And maids. All the maids I could ever... <laughs> oh, cultured. Elise is cultured. Oh, if only... You know, she's definitely an oh-ho-ho-ho -ho -ho kind of, kind of character. So I can't wait until I can hopefully do an oh-ho-ho-ho -ho -ho for her. Well, one can dream. Uh, I don't know what kind of voice this is. Elise! Oh, for goodness sake! Elise is a mood, kind of. I have, secretly have the same dreams. I believe in you, Serena. You can become a rich lady one day with all the maids you could ever want. Oh, it's a, it's a guy. Okay. Um, <clears throat> but he can still have that voice. Whatever. On your way home, lass? What are you doing wandering about in the dark, Elise? You ought to know it's dangerous out here. I'm not wandering about, Mr. Ludwig. I've been working late, if you'd so kindly believe. You know better than to put yourself in danger, Elise. If anyone's putting me in danger, it's you! Yeah! Yeah, stinky man! In the dark at night! I'd be home already had you not stopped me for an earful. Come now, Elise. We've got good reason to worry. All this vigilance. For what? What am I to be afraid of? The witch? Watch your words, Elise. You're not what to question such matters. What do you say we walk you home? I believe I'll be just fine on my own, Mr. Heinrich. No more detours, Elise. It's for your own good. Lest I come across the witch, I know. Let us hope you don't come to regret your words, lass. Oh... <laughs> like, it's like, it's like record scratch. She would come to regret her words. <laughs> Jacksama, how you doing? Don't they know it's not safe out at night? Sheesh! Oh, I can't stand these folks. Ah, uh, it's just like any other RPG game. RPG Maker game. Oh, good, we can run because we're definitely gonna have to do that. But a cute nanny! Look at the... Look at the... Look at the interface. Look at the UI. Look at the details. Look at the bread. I want to eat that bread. I am hungry. Yakuta, how have you been? I know, right? The UI is so cute. You still remember the first time I dropped the deep voice? Uh... Pine tree this... Pine tree this, pine tree that. Everything's about pine trees around here. Right Kieferberg Point, left Kieferberg Peak. I don't know where my house is. Maybe that's why they were like, oh, it's so dangerous. Because they knew that I have no sense of direction. Okay, but Elise has a sense of direction. Uh-huh. Oh, thank you, Chuck-sama. Oh, Code, I was so happy to see you. Hopefully I'll get to see you again sometime. Nekota, good to see you. How are you? Welcome in. Took me a while to figure out you press shift and not up to run. Oh! <laughs> ah, I see. Item get. Oh, we got grapes. Oh, yeah, I, j I love eating floor grapes. It gives it more, more flavor. <laughs> Thank you, Miku Lover. Welcome in. For goodness sake! Oh, for goodness 
mistake. It's impossible to keep this lantern lit in the wind. Guess I'll be finding my way home in the dark, I suppose. Turn those floor grapes into floor wine. Bibbidi bobbidi barn, turn those floor grapes into floor wine. Save often, oh yes. That is important. I like how there's a save slot zero. Anything? Any mail? Mail time! Would you happen to be the voice actor of Paimon from Genshin? Uh. Also, no, I'm not, but I would love to voice act for Genshin one day. I'm just a baby voice actor still. What in the Lord's name happened here? I ought to find my matches. Uh oh, a bear broke in. Uh. Here's the mail, it never fails. It makes me want to wag my tail. When it comes, I want to wail. Okay, where are my. Where would the matches be? In this closet? Oh, God. It's no use going in the pantry, is it? There's nothing to eat in this house. Oh, we are poor? It's a broom. Oh, we got a broom! Yeah, surely the first thing that you gotta do once your house has been broken into is to clean it. At least they didn't get into this trunk. Despite its visibly worn appearance, the old trunk keeps its contents safe and secure. I wonder what it could have been. Who in the Lord's name got into my house? Uh... Oh no, Sa. Sa. Oh, yes. Ah! 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 What? What was that thing? I... Was I dreaming or... Oh god. Uh-huh. Uh, I might not be able to uh, uh, keep it <laughs> to voice act properly when I'm screaming like that, but uh I will do my best. <laughs> Man, yeah, bad I hate it when tapestries do that. Oh yeah, I hate it. Especially the last supper tapestry at my grandparents' house. <laughs> I hate it when they start throwing food at me. What was I thinking leaving it here? Oh, that's dangerous just leaving like lit candles in your house while you're gone. It's lit in here. It's litty titty. I ought to light the fire now. Control, use lantern. Oh. Would you like my candle? Hi, Fifi. How you doing? Your time to burn stuff. Uh. Oh, there you go. What's cooking, the looking? What? Good grief! What if it was that witch the townsfolk have been going on about? Keep it together, Elise. It was definitely a burglar. Uh, is that any better, though? That said, I'm not going anywhere without my broom. Yes. Oh, yes. The weapon of choice. The broom. Totally not these ladles. What the heck is that? <sighs> Guys, where's the UV light? I found a handprint on the wall. True, Filipi true Filipino, her grandparents have a last supper piece. Of course they do. Also the Santo Ninos. <laughs> What's this filthy thing on my wall? Whoever broke into my house is getting a proper earful, that's what. Uh. Uh. Oh. Huh. An earful and a broomful, true. Is that an oven? How long has it been since they last used this thing, I wonder? Okay, she's like, oh, we have no food in the house! And then she doesn't bother cooking for herself. God, it's just like me for real, for real! <laughs> An earful of broom. Oh, that sounds painful. Oh, a menacing well. Hopefully nothing will crawl out of it. At least don't got any food, period. You know? That's sometimes a mood, but not always. This isn't the time to be watering the garden, is it? 
Water weathered by time, the well's wooden structure stands frayed and worn. Frayed and worn? <laughs> only there was food to go with this food, if only. Alrighty, maybe it's. Ah, that's. That's a. Uh, kind of. Menacing looking. Maybe I shouldn't. Oh, what a beautiful view! I could go call for help, but. No. Not a chance. I'll deal with this mess myself. So stubborn. You should probably just call for help. I'm just gonna leave. <laughs> yeah. Okay, fine, fine, fine. I've never played Monkey Island before. Hello? Hideous! Just kidding, just kidding, just kidding, just kidding. It's just a cute little Rosin Marine. She's a cute little Rosin Marine. Be nice to her. There you are, you shameless thief! Out with it! Give me back all you took! Uh. Right? Hurry it up! Now! Oh my god! Don't smack her! Don't smack her! <laughs> don't don't smack Wait, please! Don't smack her! <laughs> please forgive me! <laughs> I'm calling out all of you guys that thought I was the voice actor for Roz and Marine at first. <laughs> Explain yourself, you wretch! What were you doing in my house? Wait! Please don't hit me! I was just hiding! They were these men and I... I won't ask you a second time! Thief! Hurry it up! Oh my god! <laughs> it is a very good animation, though! <laughs> Do not smack the baby! Stop! Give me back everything you took right now! I didn't take anything! So, um, fun fact, I actually was gonna was gonna be the the VA for Muffy <laughs> at first as well. Um But I mean like me and Aru have like similar enough voices that like that it ended up working. She did such a good job as Muffy too. I'm really I'm really really happy for her that she got to do Muffy as well as Rosin Marine. Um, yeah, um, Rosin Marine and Muffy do have the same, the same voice actor, it's true. I was just scared! Please, I beg of you! Hmm. Show me your hands! Oh, but I... I didn't take anything, ma'am! Huh? Now show me your pockets, and make it quick! I keep telling you! I didn't steal anything, ma'am. Dude, that's me for real, for real. Random coins, buttons, flowers I picked, and like a cough drop. Like two cough drops. <laughs> this is all I have. I swear. Coins and wheat? What are you doing up here in the mountains? Oh, that's... I am a traveler, ma'am. Huh? Turn around. You say you're a traveler. Are you all by yourself? Uh Yes. Yes, I'm traveling alone. I hoped I could rest for the night in this village, but... I saw some people walking in the woods. It frightened me, so I ran to find some place to hide. Be that as it may, you're still... Oh, but I... Oh, please forgive me, ma'am. I didn't mean to make such a mess. Well, you don't usually just, like, break into somebody's house even if you're scared. You, you like, hide behind... The house. Or hide in... Behind the tree. I don't know, maybe I just never have had to break into somebody's house cause out of fear before. Oh my gosh, this music. I didn't mean to make such a mess. It's so spooky, this music! Oh, shush it! Would you stop calling me that? Uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. For goodness sake. Hmm. Alright, well... I might let you go. If you can prove your innocence, that is. I can do, ma'am. Ah, uh, take care, Nectarines, and have a good day at work! Oyasubi! Uh, you can start by cleaning up this mess. And then, you can... I'm sorry, I... Ma'am? 
by the way, is the is the audio balance okay? Feel free to let me know if I should put it down or up the the game sound. And hello, cafe manager. Little goody two shoes is beautiful as it is psychotic. Oh, no problems, no problem at all. I'm glad that you that you love it so far. Ma'am? I did it! Yes! That's it! A maid! She's like, I did it! I finally achieved part of my dream! I got myself a maid! <laughs> Alright! Listen carefully now. First, you'll be tidying up the mess you've made. In fact, you can clean my whole house from top to bottom. That'll teach you not to go storming into strangers' homes. Sorry, I... I... Ma'am... <laughs> Complaining already, are you? Wouldn't you agree this is the least you can do? Uh, yes. Uh, of course. I'll gladly do it, ma'am. <laughs> Good. And in exchange, I suppose you can stay here. But no more thieving. Huh. I am not a thief, ma'am. <laughs> I'll be the judge of that, thank you very much. Anyhow, you work for me, and I'll give you a place to stay. Fair enough, wouldn't you say? <laughs> it does sound fair, ma'am. And it is very kind of you, but... <laughs> oh, thank you. Thank you so much, yeah. I'm also very happy every day that I became a voice actor. Though I have a lot more to learn and improve on. I am not a thief! Uh. Fine, you're not a thief. Now, would you stop calling me ma'am? Do I look like an old hag to you? <gasps> I'm sorry. You don't. I... apologize. All right. My name is Elise, and you best remember it. Uh, yes. Ah! <laughs> bah! Hi, Ego! Good to see you! How are you? <laughs> no, I'm just Southern. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I, for I forgot to introduce myself. Ah! Selenic Wanderer. Rosin Marine. What a cutie patootie! <laughs> My name is Rosin Marine. It's a pleasure to meet you, Miss Elise. For goodness sake. Just Elise is fine. Come now. You have a lot of work to do. <laughs> yes, of course. I like how she just. kind of. accepts this indentured servitude. She's not like, well, maybe you could like lead me to an inn in the in the village or something like that. No, she's like, oh yeah, I'm 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 okay cohabitating with this person that smacked me with a broom a bunch of times. Stay safe, Roz. Stay safe. The steam achievement scared you, Gomende. <laughs> How could you even do all this? Look at my floors. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, you know, it, it's it is true. Like, no matter how scared she was, how did she just kind of like knock everything over? Why is there like a black handprint on the wall? And why was why did my tapestry grab me? And I just have a lot of questions. Also, hi, Papalaron. Welcome in. <laughs> yeah, it is kind of impressive she could do all that. Maybe it's like Baldur's Gate, and she's a druid, and she can become a bear. Maybe not exactly like Baldur's Gate. Maybe maybe I shouldn't make that comparison. Even Granny's plates shattered to pieces. What the heck? Okay, yeah, she should pay me back for this. What the heck? What are you, a wild boar? I'm surprised you didn't break my windows and tear down the walls. <laughs> All right. Well, you know what you did. Anyway... Anyhow, here, take this. Make certain you get into every nook and cranny, you hear? Yeah, get rid of all the spiders, please. The ones that I was too scared to get rid of. Hmm. I am your peepee -pee hero? Peepee -pee hero? What's a peepee -pee hero? Hey? Eh? Yes, ma'am. While you're at it, you can sweep the chimney and clean up the fireplace, too. Oh, and wipe that stain off my wall and wash all my windows. All right. I want this place sparkling by the time I wake up tomorrow. Understood? Uh, of course. Of course, ma'am. I like how Elise's personality is angry. <laughs> and I told you to quit calling me that. I'm sorry. Come now. Let me show you to the to the well out the back. Out the oh, back. But I... Oh, she already knows where the well is. Sussy. Sussy. 
anything to make up for what I've done. Look here, Lassie. I have no good reason to trust you. I... I didn't mean to... Every single corner of this house is to be absolutely spotless by sunrise. Dare to cross me even once, and I'll be having a word with the townsfolk. You here? Are we clear? Yes, Elise. Oh, I'm sorry. I... I'll do my best. Hmm. Be careful not to wake me either. I have Sunday Mass to attend tomorrow. Hmm. Didn't take her as a religious person. I'll keep quiet. Good night, Elise. Elise is really on a power trip. Well, this is what she's always wanted! To be able to boss people around! Oh, oh! That's the... That's the speed up animation. That scared me. Maybe she's a werewolf, saw the moon and transformed or something. Maybe. Can you, like, close the door, though, Rosin Marine, please? I'm like... I don't want bugs to come in. Now you've done it, Elise. There was hardly a need to be that harsh, but still. Ah, oh, she's such a soon dead it. Oh, Elise, my love. Also, hi, chemist. How you doing? Oh, she's oh, she's so cute. She's she's just a softy. Are you Freya's voice actress? Yes, I am, chemist. Mm hmm. That was so Freya of you. <laughs> What if she's dangerous, or... Mm. Worse, even. What if... She's the witch the townsfolk have been talking about. Then maybe you shouldn't have invited her to your house! Evil spirits can only come in if you invite them in. Mm. But Elise sounds like you, too. Um... Does she? Huh. Well, I'm flattered if you think so, because I look up to Diana a lot. I look up to all the VAs in this game a lot. Oh, what would Granny Holly do, I wonder? She didn't raise me to be like this. I even threatened to tell on her, too. What's done is done, I suppose. I'll make sense of it tomorrow. It's best I go to bed. Oh, boy. Sontag! I wonder what language... is it... German? Mm. It's morning already... Ah, uh, Elise morning hair, cute! I can't be late for Sunday Mass or Father Hands will... You can't be serious! Good grief, what was I thinking? She's probably taken everything I own by now! I mean, you were super tired and it was late at night, so your judgment was probably a little on the loopy side. You will lose one bread for each time period that passes by. That's six bread a day. Oh no, six bread a day! I don't even eat six bread a day! Hello, Fies. Welcome in. Manage your normal food and key items. Blah, blah, blah. Consume. Consume! What a cute little room. What she got in here? I really ought to go through all this junk sometime, I suppose. Anything in here? All these... Yeah, there's ten different endings in the game. We will be getting... at least one of them. Not today, but like... over the course of this stream series. Red economy going down Yes. What's in this room? It's been a long time since I've gone into Granny Holly's room. Not that there's anything to see he there, anyhow. Oh, man. Oh, frozen? Frozen clock. Perhaps that's symbolic. Are we gonna 100% this game? Maybe, but at the very least, I want to get Freya's ending. Freya's good ending. If I can. <laughs> or maybe not. Wow! See? Rosie Marine's a good girl and she did a good job, but she left the door open. Why? Why you leave the door open? Doesn't it seem like she took or broke anything, but... Hey! Rosie Marine! I... okay, so the... 
The silly thing is that Elise always calls Rosemarine the wrong thing. But then, like, the, the voice... the voiceover line says it correctly. <laughs> Rosemarine! Was that her name? Oh, I can't believe she tidied, tidied up and left just like that. I didn't even give her anything to eat last night. The poor thing. Uh... Now, where could she have gotten to? I mean, she probably went back to the, the little shed thing, right? It always confused you. <laughs> I think it would have been nice to... Um, have Diana record another line of her saying it, like, wrong. Rose and Marine is true. Rosemary? But Rosemarine is just wrong. It's like if somebody called me Phobe. Don't call me Phobe, I'm Phoebe. I bet she's in here. But we gotta go to Sunday Mass. Is this her new house? She lives in here now. Rose and Marie. She lives in here. I'm not Phobe! No Phobe! Rosemarine! For goodness sake. There you are, you. Honestly, what are you going? What are you doing here? I'm sorry. I was intending to leave first thing in the morning, but I was afraid I'd get lost in the dark. Never mind. Come with me now. I'm sorry. I... Are you taking me to the village? Huh? Who do you take me for? Some wretch? <laughs> Wait, what? Why? Why would that be? Everyone's calling me Phobe. Phobe, Chobe. Fifi Poom Poom, stop! Hey! No! Fuck for you're being a bad influence! <laughs> Petition to start calling our Queen Bee Debbie. Why Debbie? <laughs> Forget what I said last night. Not exactly my finest moment. I. I didn't mean to be such a brute, truth be told. I'm sorry for what I did, too. For goodness sake. I got it. All of that's dead and buried. Now, come. I'm running late for Sunday Mass. Yes. Uh, wait for me, Elise. So we're not taking her with us to Sunday Mass? I mean, that would be a good time to introduce her to the village. So that they don't get sus about her being the witch, but whatever. Froyo? I'm not frozen yogurt! If anything, call me ice cream. Or gelato. Flock? Who's Flock? <gasps> Get a little bouncy sound! Boing, 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 boing. Flock Fluffy Companion. <laughs> baby! Where's the baby? We have a pet now. Can we pet him? Please tell me we can pet him. Can you pet so the goal? <laughs> this will truly be the best game on the face of this earth if you can pet the animals in it. Where have you been? Look at these babies! Two babies! Two peas in a pod! Two baby peas in a pod! Hmm. You know this goat? Uh, of course. Yes, of course! We met on the way to Kieferberg. We've been together since. <laughs> yes, we were. We were. Oh, he's the cuddliest little thing, isn't he? Phoebe voices the goat, too. <laughs> the cuddliest little thing, you say. Anyway. Oh, maybe we can't pet them because... Because Freya would not pet them. Not Freya, um... Because Elise would not pet them. Hmm. Satanic goat. A uh, no, there's no way. He's a little baby and he has a little ribbon on him. Yes, he does. He's very fashionable. Anyhow, I got... I ought to get going. Wouldn't want to be late for Sunday Mass. Uh, yes. <laughs> I'll be back in a moment, Flock. Need a route for the goat, but instead of romance, you just cl get closer to petting him. <gasps> That'd be amazing! I have to say, you did a decent job tidying up. You did pretty much everything I asked you to. Pretty much? What did she not do? What's the one thing she didn't do? Oh, I'm so glad. Elise needs to earn the right to stand before the goat's presence. <laughs> earn the right? How? I wanted to assure you I meant no harm, Elise. You kept me up for hours last night thinking you'd... Oh, 
shush it! I get it already, no need to tell me. It's so funny, the voice lines are so angry! <laughs> Here, have some bread. You must be hungry. Uh, yes. <laughs> Thank you, Elise. You really are too kind. For goodness sake. Good grief. You do remember I hit you with a broom, right? That's what I that's what I'm saying! <laughs> Called you a thief, made you do my bidding and whatnot. <laughs> Most folks would have tossed me right out the moment they found me, but you didn't. Hmm. I suppose I didn't. Anyhow, I'm heading out. All right. Don't wander about and don't make a mess. Uh, of course. I don't. I don't know. She. She. She made a big mess the other night, completely on accident. Yeah, I'm having a great time, oppressor. Thank you for asking. Let's see. Adaptations? Oh, Little Goody Two Shoes Anime OVA? When? Talk to your favorite girl when you see a. Oh, I can get a romantic date for later. <gasps> I mean, I, I knew I said I was going to do free as well. I knew, but I. Let me just listen to Roz and Marine's request. Let me just listen. Because it would be. be so mean of me not to. Uh, before you go, Lise. Hmm? I have something to tell you if... You could come meet me later today. What's keeping you from telling me now? Uh, well, it's important, so... I'll be in the back by nightfall, alright? For goodness sake. It best be worth my while, you hear? Uh, I promise it's nothing bad. We'll see about that. She's so cute, though. Can I romance them all? Please? <laughs> Hi, Ryoto-san. Hachi. You on Freya's route now? <gasps> I'm so happy. I hope you enjoy it. What's in here? Would you like to revisit the game tutorials? No! No tutorial, please. Alright, let's save here. Oh, thank you, Oppressor. I'm definitely doing a lot better than I was when I was sick during my birthday stream. <gasps> Lane! Lane, thank you so much for the raid. I really appreciate it. Welcome in. Everybody, please give lots and lots of love to Lane, who is the Cheryl to my Ronka. And a very, very dear friend of mine. And also, she's a voice actor too. For those of you guys that just came in with the raid, welcome in. I am Freya. Wait, no, I'm not Freya. <laughs> I'm not Freya. Wait, I'm. I am Phoebe. I am your 2.5D fair, 2.5D fairy tale idol that loves to write my own songs in English and in Japanese and sing them on both the IRL and the virtual stage. I also am an aspiring voice actress that just got to voice act for this game that I'm playing right now, Little Goody Two Shoes. And the character I voiced is named Freya. And that's the that's the character that I'm using the PNG for right now. Yeah, Phoebe having an identity crisis. I mean, Phoebe and Freya both have the f sound, the f sound. Um, today we're starting my new stream series, um, on YouTube and Twitch, where I'm going to be playing through Freya's route and voice acting the whole thing. So, um, I'm really, really happy to welcome you guys in. Please take a seat, get nice and comfy and cozy, and um, feel free to uh, to play along with us. And yes, thank you so much, Midge, for linking my music. Feel free to listen to my music. You can also use exclamation point Spotify if you want to check out my Spotify links as well. Um, I have a lot of music, and my dream is to reach as many people the world over with my voice. So that means a lot to me. Lane, how was your stream? What did you guys do? You know what? It's a dream of mine to voice act with Lane in something one day. Lane, let's make that happen together one day. Please, 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 please. Huh? And please go, feel free to go get some rest after your stream if you would like to. Oh, okay, so the map also shows us our quests. We have to attend Sunday Mass. Why are we the only one that lives all the way out here in the forest? Don't forget to stay hydrated. Oh, thank you for reminding me. Let me do that. Hi, Bennett. I 
can't sing Phoebe's praises enough, so please give so much love where able. Please, I want to voice act with you too. Please, I would love to. I would love, love, love to. Can we add Phobe as your nth nickname? People, some people already call me Phobe, so feel free, but I will hold it against you. <laughs> what? Oh, one minute. There you go. To the town! But yeah, why are we the only? We are the little witch in the woods. Perhaps. Maybe we are the witch and we just don't know it. I don't know. What are your theories? Tell me your theories, chat. Oh, but those of you guys that have already played it! No spoilers! No spoilers, no spoilers. Look at how beautiful all the backgrounds are as well. No, 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 no. Where is the town? Is it this way? Ah, yes, this must be the town. There you are, Elise. Maybe not the witch, but, but, but... Maybe Elise has too much risk, so she secludes herself to give everyone else a chance at romance in town. You are so right. You are so correct. Come here, why don't you? What is cute little old lady? I want to be as cute as this cute little old lady when I am a little old lady one day. Good day, Gret and Gretel. Oh, her name's Gretel. Is there a Hansel too? On your way to mass, I see. Anything to keep Father ha Hans off my back. I, I have some fresh buns. Let's cheer you right up. Why don't you take a look? Do I have to buy them from you? She's itty bitty! So itty and so bitty! It's always lovely seeing you, Elise. What's ya buying? What's ya selling? <laughs> um, do I even have any money? Oh, I only have 10 coins. Oh my gosh. Um, I guess I can buy myself one bread. Yeah, that's all I can afford right now is one bread. I guess game wants me to buy the bread. Cha cha. Pori! Buy a pretzel. I couldn't. I'm too broke. Otherwise, I would have. I'll buy you a pretzel later on, Pori. And I'll make it come with a... With a... Beer cheese dip. How you been doing, Pori, my dude? Yeah, uh, Phoebe Hive. How have you all been? I've missed you so much. And those of you guys that are new to the Phoebe Hive... I am so happy to welcome you in. Also, thank you very much, Freds and Lima, Man of Mules, and uh, Nenekoko Tata for the follows. Uh, feel free to join my Discord server if you guys would like to get news and notices and also um, hang out with your fellow bees. Been hanging in there, working hard to pay rent and afford car payments. I believe in you! Phoebe has also been working really hard to, uh... Pay the bills and eat the foods and stuff. Hello? Everything alright, Miss Linda? Oh, Elise. Would you take a look at my poor flowers? That windstorm nearly uprooted all of them from their pots. Oh, there was a windstorm. That's why there's all these twigs everywhere. What windstorm? Has nobody told you? Why, you've seen all these branches scattered about town. I heard Brunhild... Brunhilda's roof nearly came off. So well, that's how you spell Brunhilda. Uh, bye, 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 happy animate. I'll see you later on, okay? Much happy to be here. I'm happy that you're here as well, too, what they says. Fallout 76 consumed your, you as your MMORPG. Um... This game makes you realize very quickly that Elisa's attitude may almost be justified. I mean, she's got a... Every... Well, she's not a villain, but everybody has a reason why they act the way that they do. And, I mean, Elisa's grandma died, she lives all by herself, she's poor and doesn't have food... And, um... There's spooky stuff, it seems, going on in the village. Oh, it was a sight you wouldn't believe, lass. Branches and leaves piled up high against folks' doors, entire treetops, some of them. Surely that's a bit of an exaggeration. The alleys took a beating, that's for certain. Some say they heard the wind knocking at their doors. Old Jockin says it might have been the witch herself, but... 
Oh, here we go again. Oh, is old Jock in like the, the village like... Crazy old guy? You can never be too certain, lass. Anyhow, I'll be heading inside now, folks. Let us hope for a better night's sleep this evening. May the Lord hear you, Wilhelm. Oh, Jockin. Oh boy, I wonder what old Jockin is gonna be like. Good, good seeing you, Elise. Oh, it must have been even worse up in the mountains. It wasn't that bad, believe it or not. Oh, that's such a relief. I'm afraid we weren't as lucky, sadly. Oh, I do hope nobody was hurt. We can thank both the Lord and St. Walpurga. Walpurga? Like, Walpurgis knocked? Like, like, Madoka? Like a witch? Nobody was, but many of the townsfolk got their windows shattered and their roof tiles blown off. What about you, Mr. Heinrich? Oh, it was awful. Our window shutters were ripped right off their hinges. It'll take all day to tidy up and fix everything. That's all right, dearest. The sooner we get to it, the sooner it'll be done. I can lend a hand if you'd like me to, Mrs. Ariane. Oh, that's all right, Elise. Come now, you two. We'd best get inside. Oh yeah, it is church time. Save our progress. Oh, can you pet the dog? Little doggy, can you pet the dog? You can't pet the dog! Ah, oh, sadness. Oh, being, being Maguka is suffering. <laughs> Maple Story vibes. Yeah, Maple Story vibes, dog. You're right, though. Oh, man. I remember trying to get into Maple Story when I was really, really little because my, uh, my childhood friends were really, really big into Maple Story. Um, and then. I got, tried to get... I couldn't really stick with it. And then I tried to get back into it when Angelic Buster came out. Because I was like, ooh, pink magical girl. I gotta. And then I couldn't stick with it. <laughs> uh... Goodness, Elise. You look dreadful. <sighs> Good morning to you too, Mrs. Bertha. What do you mean I look dreadful? She looks lovely. Hi, Korgoth. How you doing? I will defeat Brazilian Knight. <laughs> Exactly, exactly. How you doing, Korgoth? Good morning to you too, Miss B Mrs. Bertha. Oh, I wasn't certain you'd come today, Elise. Why wouldn't I, Mrs. Mrs. Odile? 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 My, Elise, you do look quite tired. Couldn't catch a wink, I'd wager. Frightening, wasn't it? Oh, I must have been dreadful up in the mountains. Not at all. It seems you folks had it worse than I did. My, now that's hard to believe. That was no ordinary windstorm, I tell you. How so, Odili? 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 I don't know. Odili! Okay, thank you. Oh, I've about had it with this nonsense. She's saying it came from the woodland, that's what. Oh, Odile, it's no use entertaining such notions, my dear. You'll see, Marielle. All I can see is we're running late for mass. Goodness, what has Kieferberg come to? After you, Elise. <sighs> the woodland, huh? Odile? Odile? Hmm, I don't know, we'll figure it out. <gasps> is that... Elise! Elise! <laughs> Elise! What if I try to... <laughs> it... <laughs> it me... It me... <laughs> what? Good morning, Elise. Evergreen sweetheart. Oh. Now let me stare at the portrait longer. Mm. How are you always so cheery, Freya? Well, it's hard not to be cheery around someone like you, Elise. Oh my god, I need to stop. I need to stop. I'm gonna start flirting with Elise. I'm gonna just like constantly be flirting with Elise every time Freya's on the screen. You took so long. You took too long. Then your candy's gone. <laughs> Just kidding. You took so long. I thought you weren't coming. I overslept a little, I suppose. 
didn't get that much sleep last night. What can we do? Oh, me neither. And all because of that windstorm. Not even my little sprig could help me. Your... sprig? So the funny thing about this... <laughs> I keep a tiny sprig of lavender under my pillow, you see? Sniffing it helps me sleep better. And it leaves such a lovely... So the, the funny thing about this is that I do something similar too. I have... <laughs> I have a lavender scented Vicks. Hold on, I have it with me right now. I keep it next to my bed. I have lavender scented Vicks Vapor Rub. And I, I sniff it to make me feel better. <laughs> or like to help me sleep or to calm me down. Or if I have the snifflies, then it helps with like clearing the sinuses. Pull it closer to the mic, I can't smell it. Oh, my bad, my bad. Here you go. <laughs> uh, Vix ASMR. Mm -hmm. And yes, we're gonna be rizzing ourselves today. Double the Freya, double the Phoebe. <laughs> Smells like grandma. Well, see the Vix Vapor Rub that I used when I was little, that my grandma would always um, use when I was sick. Because I was like constantly getting sick when I was little, so I constantly had Vix. It wasn't... Lavender scented, but this one is, so it, it smells a little bit more sophisticated, you know? <laughs> Just a little bit more sophisticated. Yes, the queer subtext, I love it. Shh, keep quiet, you two. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, I'm sorry, Mr. Wilhelm. Or oh, Wilhelm. We <laughs> best focus now, Lise. Shush it, you. You're the one wittering on, Freya. No, you didn't miss too much onsen. <sighs> May the blessing of the Lord, the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit be with us. Do I get yummy, uh... Church... Church biscuits? Honestly? I... I... I, I like... I like getting my... I like taking communion because I like the church biscuits. <laughs> May the hollowed Saint, Saint Walpurga take heed of our prayers. Corpse crackers, I mean, they are the body of Christ, so... Amen! Oh. Amen! This Saturday, we will once again be celebrating our patroness, Saint Walpurga. I will defeat Brazilian Night. <laughs> I feel so bad for those of you guys that don't even understand the Maguka Maduka references. I'm gonna keep making them every time they say Walpurga. As you all know, preparations for the festivities are already underway. Let us all contribute to the best of our abilities, brethren. Oh, they're preparing for a festival. That said, I am aware of what transpired last night. <sighs> oh, several of our neighbors were severely affected by the windstorm. I urge everyone to lend a hand in clearing out the alleyways. Let us all have compassion for one another in these trying times. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is a PSA to go watch Mar Maruka if you haven't yet already. I just rewatched uh, Maruka Rebellion the other day, and I remember just how good it was. Let us trust Saint Walpurga to guide our people and defeat Brazilian Night. <laughs> May the Lord be with you, brethren. Amen. Maduka is beauty. <laughs> Hi, Kiki. Good to see you. Komura is the biggest sin. <laughs> wow, Tisa. Everybody's wonderful. Oh my gosh. Hmm. I admire every single person on this cast so much. Took you all you had to get up out of bed. <laughs> Took you all you had to get out of bed this morning. I'd wager. Everyone's so darn cute. Sugary devotee. Devotee. Lab Kuhen. Hey, Ru is cool. <laughs> Very funny, Lab Kuhen. Jokes aside, Elise. Don't I keep telling you to take your apron off for Sunday Mass? I'm certain the Lord couldn't care less, so why should you? <laughs> cute. It does have an atelier vibe. 
her riling me up on purpose again, Leb. <laughs> Can you tell? For goodness sake. <laughs> Cute! Cute childhood friends. I'd best get to work now before it gets late. See you later, Elise. Don't forget to come about later, Elise. <sighs> I won't, I won't. Unlocked relationship menu. Oh boy, the romancing begins. Couldn't sleep last much last night, could you? Could you? Didn't sleep a wink. Explains the hilarity. You're hopeless, Lebkuhen. As long as you keep indulging me. So it's my fault, huh? Here you go, before I forget. It was worth talking to her. I got a pretzel. See? See, Pori, I got a pretzel and I didn't even have to buy it. Oh, you brought me my favorite. Ah, uh, her favorite's not a Leb Cool Hen? It's a pretzel? I can be a pretzel. I was a pretzel once. <gasps> pretzel? I was a pretzel once. <laughs> I don't know if Freya's hair could be a pretzel. Mr. Bernhardt said you were rather late getting home last night. Is that so? Prezossi? Excuse me? Huh? I did tell you it was almost time for supper when you stopped by. And I told you Mrs. Elma worked me like a donkey right up until nightfall. Mrs. Ber Mr. Bernhard was fretting over you is all. Mr. Bernhard can find better things to do with his time, I'm certain. You really are so stubborn, Elise. Anyhow, it's about time I head out. Say, I'll be up at the bell tower all afternoon if you'd like to keep me company. I'll be there, Lab. Oh, we made a promise. Uh... Hopefully I'll be able to follow through with that, as long as it doesn't conflict with any of my plans with Freya. Hi there, father. And father. Wait, it's father and father, because this is my father, and then that's the father. We best end... No, wait, now why am I giving him a... Why am I giving him a himbo voice? Hold on. <laughs> we best send word to Primaldorf before... Ah, Elise. Didn't see you there. Send word to Primaldorf, Mr. Gustav? We're having folks from Primaldorf lend a hand with the festival this year, Elise. I heard the windstorm wasn't as bad in the mountains, lass. Freya was fretting over you like you wouldn't believe... Of course I was. I wouldn't want my dear, dear Elise to get hurt. Oh my gosh, ugh. <laughs> Jeez, Elise, how come the game lets you have two fathers? <laughs> I mean, some people have two fathers. Lucky. She was. You ought to thank the Lord. You ought to thank the Lord for your good fortune, Elise. Certainly, Father. Hard at work even on a Sunday, are you? When aren't I, Father? Sundays are meant for rest, Elise. You let us know if you ever need a hand, you hear? Of course, Mr. Gustav. Thank you. Oh, yeah, because Gustav is Freya's dad. Thank you, Lord, for giving us Phoebe. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Lord, for giving me Phoebe Hive. I love them so much. Oh. A mysterious no. What is that? Some con convoluted tic tac toe? Hello? What's it say? There's something written on here. Hallowed Valperga, sanctified be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be. Oh, may thy will be everlasting and thy grace all embracing. Quenched thou shalt be on this Sabbath of the full moon. Can I be quenched? Oh, yeah. Sorry. Uh, hydration time. <sighs> ah. May this prayer find its restful place in thy life, Bearing Grove. It's a ransom note, 50 hugs for a kiss, delivered by tonight, or no fries for you. No fries for me! Oh, that's not good. Oh no. Guess I'll have to deliver 50 hugs. 50 hugs for my... for my Phoebe Hive? But there's more than 
50 of you guys right now. There's like... Wait, 80... Oh, there's like 100 of you guys right now. I will double the amount of hugs if you double the amount of fries. A prayer? There's something else at the bottom. Kieferberg's offering lies in the crossroads, beyond the maypole. May thy thirst be quenched, thy blessings receive. In the crossroads? I wonder who dropped this? Well, that's not menacing at all! Investigate the notes further. Mm. Oh, whoops! I offer you... <gasps> Nacho fries from Taco Bell! Wait, I want Taco Bell! I want Taco Bell! I want Taco Bell. Ugh. Maybe I'll get Taco Bell later. I don't know. I'm trying to be healthier, though. You know, last night... I stayed up until 5 in the morning watching health nut videos on YouTube. And I was like, oh yeah, I'm cutting carbs out of my diet. I'm cutting... I'm cutting sugar out of my diet. I'm cutting... Um, I'm gonna start eating more fruits and vegetables and lentils and... and... drinking health shakes. But... But you guys are enabling me! <laughs> How dare! <you? laughs> Staying up until 5 a.m. is not really healthy. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> I can't even... I don't even have a retort against that. This place always brings back such good memories. The fragrant mountain breeze frolics about the rolling hills, spreading its spring cheer all across Kieferberg. That sounds like something I would write. Like a cheesy poem that I would have written in, like, high school. Everyone give Phoebe some celery instead. <laughs> no! No celery! No celery and no celery soda, please! Oh! Oh! There's Freya! There she is! There's the girl! Yo, yo! How are you? Welcome in. Though, to be fair, I was up until 6 a.m. Hey! Well, maybe you had a better reason than me. Than watching health nut videos on YouTube. <laughs> ants on a log is so good. Okay, maybe I will try the log if there are ants on... No, no, no! I hate both raisins and celery! I literally would only eat the peanut butter, and at that point, it's just peanut butter. Thank goodness that's over. What a bore. To think I'll have to work all day until the evening. Hello there. Time periods. Yes, I understand. <gasps> Elise! I was waiting for you. Waiting for me? I almost forgot to give you this. Ointment. Ah! It's my... It's my lavender-scented Vix! You mentioned your hands were feeling dry, right? Oh, you didn't have to, Freya. I use it right before bed every night. It does wonders for the skin. I put a little lavender in there, too. Wait... You made this yourself? Of course I did! Oh, wait! Oh, I didn't even know that that was, that was gonna be the next line. I was just like... <laughs> I was just like... Saying what I thought. But yeah, of course I did, silly! Same with the raisins and celery? Oh my gosh, Cyberpunk, you're just like me for real, for real. That's Papa's favorite. His hands are always dry, you see? You do have a knack for this sort of thing, don't you? Uh, so I'm told, I suppose. Anyhow, I'd best move along before it gets late. Say, Elise, I was wondering... I'm going to pick some flowers this afternoon up in the mountains. Would you like to go on a date with me? Flowers? I thought maybe you might care to join me, if you'd like. Alright, I'll be there, Freya. That's wonderful! Have a nice day, Elise. Uh, a date! Wah! Wah! We're going on a date! We're going on a date! Wait... What's gotten into her? Wait, but I can't do both things. So... Lev Kuhan wants to meet at the church tower in the afternoon. 
Freya wants to meet on the mountain at the afternoon. We can do Rose and Marie and still, because I think it's at sunset. It's at, like, dusk. Mm -hmm. Phoebe's voicing Freya's inner monologue. Indeed. <laughs> Honestly, they really did... They really did choose the best possible character for me to voice, I think. I think second best probably would have been... Rosin Marine? Um, when I was little, I was more of a Rosin Marine, but nowadays I'd say I'm more of a Freya. Yeah, flower picking day! That is precisely the kind of date that I would take Phoebe Hive on. Well, I've taken you guys on a flower picking ASMR date before, haven't I? Oh, what a mess. I won't be going through here anytime soon, I suppose. Wait, how did Freya get through here? Freya just walked the heck through here! Huh? Oh my gosh. That's kind of spooky. Can't be bothered to lend a hand in the alleys only... I'm just... Oh, I, I, I literally just got out of mass right now. Both can look after their own homes, I'd say. Sparing yourself on a Sunday, I'd see. I see. As a matter of fact, I happen to work every Sunday, Mrs. Lorelei. All right, all right. Whatever you say, lassie. Say, have you seen my niece by chance? Molly? I'll take it you haven't been. No, I don't... Oh, Muffy! Muffy's her niece! No, I don't think I have, Mrs. Lorelei. She's been up to no good lately, you see. Running about begging for food, skipping class. Who knows what else? I see. Nothing a good whipping can't fix, anyhow. Oh my god, don't whip her! Even if she's naughty! Oh my gosh. I wouldn't be so certain. Won't that make her rebel more? Uh... You've... You've seen what it did to the alleys, Muriel. Oh, Odili, what are we to do with you? Is everything alright, Mrs. Muriel? Odili here is making too much of that windstorm is all. You'll see, Muriel. Oh god, crazy old people. See what, Mrs. Odili? Old Jockin's right, lass. That windstorm... Oh, we don't need two crazy old people! Lend a hand in the alley gave me the wrong impression. Oh my god, Melania! Stop! <laughs> Sadly, have to go to a... Oh, have a wonderful time at the birthday party, Bennett. Oh yeah, Sylvie. Thank you so much for being here. Cat under the tree! Can we pet? We must see. It's that wretched witch. For goodness sake. You'd best be keeping such thoughts to yourself, Odili. The townsfolk are already frightened. You wouldn't want to make it worse. Why, I'm simply trying to alert folks to the... You ought to watch your words, dearie. That's what happens when you try Mrs. Marielle's patience, I suppose. Cat! 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 Cat is sleeping. It's... Surely it's not that we do, can't pet the cat. Surely it's just that cat is sleeping. So we wouldn't want to interrupt, right? I love the town theme too. Also, Bird, thank you so much for resubscribing for 24 months, a whole two years. Cannot believe it. Thank you so much. Welcome back to the Beehive. Also, thank you, Fredson, for the follow as well earlier. We can't all leave Kieferberg over this nonsense. Leaving? Huh? Leaving? Who's leaving? Oh, Elise, it's that witch folks keep wittering on about. That windstorm couldn't have been a mere coincidence, old Jockins. Calm down, Brunhilda. Think of your baby. Now, I'm not one to believe such things, but... I thought you weren't buying into this nonsense, Mrs. Bertha. Why, who are you to say it's nonsense, Elise? Um, you're jumping to conclusions, I'd say. We all know old Jockin's making too much of it, as usual. Oh, I hope you're right. Of course we do, Elise. It's just... Last night was so frightening, it left us all wondering. I understand, Mrs. Dorothy, yet fretting like this isn't... Worrying like this won't get us anywhere. Truly, Mrs. Bertha, you're right. Oh, for goodness sake, they're not... Okay, oh, suspicion down. What did I... Well, that's good. Uh, what did I do? How do I go to the menu menu? Oh, yeah, like that. 
their suspicion. And then... Ah! Come on, I, uh... Dropped my... Dropped my mouse real quick. Let's see... Oh, Where is the... Where is the... There it is. Wow, we have a cute little locket full of pictures of our sweethearts. I love Love Kuhen's like slightly smug expression. You made the less sus choice. Ah, that's good. <laughs> Are we able to pick up the twigs? Let me check. Let me check. Yeah, I was just trying to be nice, but I guess I chose the good option. Ah, uh, we cannot pick up the twigs, unfortunately. We still cannot pet the dog! Nonsense! The portraits are so sweet. Yeah, so that's... Um, that's a special mechanic in this game. Is like, trying to make it so that, uh... Is it afternoon yet or is it morning? Oh, it's morning. It's morning. I guess we can do some work. What kind of work is this? Okay. Ooh, fetching eggs from the coop. Ah! Yeah, there's lots of cute mini games in this game as well. Mm hmm. The game's name is Little Goody Two Shoes, after all. True. Leave it to me, Mrs. Ariane. Careful with the hands now, you hear? I dare say they're still riled up after last night. My people. Yes, yes, I'm going to grab, collect all the Joga Bogies. Joga Bogies and egg, after all. Oh, my gosh. Joga, I just noticed. <laughs> the gay implications of you being an egg. Oh my gosh. I mean, the trans implications of you being an egg. I am such... I am... After all these years, I took so long. I took so long to realize. A fool I am. Anyway, chicken frenzy! Oh! I learned recently that an egg is somebody who is, uh... Who is a... Closeted trans femme. <clears throat> so... It might not have been on purpose. But like... It's... It's like... It's like... Cute little egg. Yeah. Okay, anyway, we're picking eggs. Hello, Higgins! It is I, Freya, from Little Goody Two Shoes. Oh. Wait, am I... Am I doing okay? I hope I'm not too slow. Oh, owie! Ah! Oh. I can't tell if I'm doing good or not. Round two. Okay. Yeah. If you tried to do this IRL, I would probably also get pecked. Ah. I mean, same the fuck and S. Huh? <laughs> How? You're really good at that, by the way. Really? Again. I have to pay to try again? Heck no! But, uh... Well, I guess we did good Eggmaster Thieves! Tis I, the Eggmaster! Maybe it was a love pack. Mm -hmm. Are you right? Maybe it was a little love pack. Mm -hmm. Not bad for a first time. Oh, thank you. Hopefully they'll get even better and better. My Elise, you got carried a... What? Is she not happy with me collecting this many eggs? Uh, I suppose I may have. Atta girl. Oh, she likes it. Okay, that's good. 
Here you go, for all your hard work. Wow! That's six times as much money I had this morning! Your score's all that matters with the mini games, not performance. Oh... I got an Atta Girl! Can I get head pats, please? Please, 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 head pat, pat, pat! Seems I'll be making Heinrich's favorite tonight, it seems. Oh, almost rice. Ah, thank you for the head pat. You know what? I gotta... I gotta open up YouTube memberships at some point, too, so that I can, uh... I can, um... Have, um, emotes for the YouTube people as well. Would you guys... Would that even... Would you guys... Would there be a purpose to that? Would you like it if I opened up YouTube memberships? Or would there be like... Would that be kind of redundant because I already have Twitch subs? But I'm, I am really, really happy that I get to like... Do this series every week again and... Talk to my Phoebe Hive every week again. I would love to see you stream more on YouTube. Oh, definitely, definitely I will. I mean, it wouldn't hurt. I would member on YouTube. I'd member on YouTube. Hmm. Any excuse, people? Oh. <laughs> I mean, I don't want to, like, make people feel pressured, though, you know? I feel it's a bit redundant, but I'm sure some people will be glad to sub in both places or just on YouTube. Oh, oh yeah, Cat doesn't use Twitch. That's true, that is true. Oh, I'd be happy to open it up <laughs> specifically for you, Cat. <laughs> we'll see, I'll look into it. Um, I do have, like, an official music artist channel on YouTube, so I need to check and see if, like, I can even open memberships or not. <laughs> Kuhin and I used to play about in the water all the time, didn't we? Though, we're a little too old for that now, I so No, you're not! Phoebe loves going to the mall and running through the water... The, the like, the little water fountain... That, for the kids. I love doing that. Me and my friend Pumpkin do that together. Or... Huh? Oh my gosh, one drive. <laughs> Sorry. There you go. Oh, look at these kids. They're so small. Elise, Elise. I'm busy. Shoo shoo. You're so boring, Elise. Show them, Elise. Show them you're not boring. No wonder you're always in such a bad mood, Elise. Muffy! Oh, I'll... Did she, did she... Did she say Muffy? Muffy's not there. Oh, I'll tell you who's always in a bad mood, you little... Please, Elise, come play with us! She won't! She's a coward! <laughs> I guess she's just used to yelling at Muffy? I know, where's Muffy? Coward! Coward! Oh, I'll show you the coward. Give me that! What's she gonna do? Wah! Elise is a pro! Wah! Oh, in uh, Japanese she says, Konogaki! Oh, that, that makes sense. That makes sense then. How did you do that, Elise? Oh, she's good. You did it from so far away, Elise! You're making too much of it, you brats. Your arms are longer, that's why. Cheater! You're a cheater! Oh, what? Huh? Hello, SF. How you doing? <laughs> Tis I, the Frey Eye. Frey Eye? <laughs> why, you? Too easy. Personally, I'm more of a YouTube person than Twitch. Twitch is cool, don't get me wrong, but I'm all about that YouTube life. Then maybe I better look into YouTube memberships. I do want to start doing some like long for like longer form like vlog YouTube content and stuff, or like um like a radio show, like a Phoebe radio show. I thought about starting that on YouTube because I've been listening to a lot of uh, Mame Guten's um radio show from back when she like debuted. Yeah, so I could do a radio show and you guys could like uh, I could have a submission box so you guys can submit stuff for me to read on stream, and it would be fun. Yeah, so I, I think I'll probably start that up at some point. Like a real idol. Would you ever make music videos? <gasps> Eerie, I have made music videos, actually. If you do, um... You're in Twitch chat right now, so if you do exclamation point YouTube, then you can get a link to my YouTube channel. And I have music videos there. 
Though, I would love to make IRL music videos. Um, the problem mostly for that is budget, because they're very, very expensive. And, like, finding locations and stuff. I didn't realize you were Freya's voice actor. You have a friend that worked in this game as well. <gasps> Which friend was it? Everybody worked so hard and did a wonderful job. And also, yes, I'm, um, I'm Freya's voice actor in both the English and the Japanese version. So, yeah, here's Muffy. What are you doing here, Melly? I love how she just calls her the wrong thing every single time. Wow! Thank you so much for the hydrate! Thank you, thank you! <laughs> I appreciate the, the super chat! <sighs> oh, it's Molly! I mean Melly! I mean Missy! I mean Moxie! Also, hi Iridacid! I'm so happy to see you! How have you been? Okay, so you guys are gonna get a little taste of what it would have been like if I was the VA for Muffy instead. But, um, I think that Aru did such a wonderful job. I cannot top that at all. I'm so glad that you've been great, Eerie. I'm so glad also. Hi, Yan! Good to see you! Welcome in, welcome in. Found yourself intro on Twitter the other day. Welcome, I'm so happy to welcome you to the Phoebe Hive. And I hope you have a really cozy time here. Matilda. <laughs> Elise! I'm doing nothing. N nothing at all. Stuffing yourself full of Miss Lizbeth's apples again, are you? Oh, but th they are really sweet, Elise. Keep your grubby hands off me, Mindy. <laughs> so mean. Oh my gosh. She worked on the environmental art. <gasps> oh, I know who. I know who. Y um, Yoni, right? Kira Yoni? I am such a big fan. If it is Kiryani, I'm such a, a big, big, big fan of her art for a long time. I've been wanting to commission her for stuff for like ever. Um, that does sound bad. Mm -hmm. You're lost. I mean, we could have gotten an apple for free, but whatever. This goat is not as cute as as flock. Neither is this one. Uh, what time of day is it right now? Oh, it's afternoon! We have a date! We have a very important date with fate! Oh, hey, it's our dad again. Dad. Papa! Working on a Sunday again, Elise? Ought to keep myself fed, I'd say. Say, Elise, we've been considering rebuilding these homes. These piles of rubble? What for? Told you, fellas. Not a soul in Kieferberg will give it time of day. I don't see how it would be worth the hassle, that, that's all. Now you're thinking of a bunny who's late for a very important date. I'm late, I'm late, I'm late! Phoebe in Wonderland. Phoebe in Whimsyland! It's such a shame. They're sitting right by the village square, too. But who would choose to settle in Kieferberg of all places? Come now, folks. If we don't rebuild our new town, who will? You're right, Gustav. This is our home after all. There's no swaying you two, is there? I mean, I gotta commend them for their enthusiasm. Maybe it could be a new home for me and my wife. If that was a theme park, you would go... See, I would love to... I did the... I did do Phoebe and Whimsyland. Um, single day maid cafe. And thank you so much, everybody that showed up to that, by the way. That made me really, really happy. Um, hopefully I'll be able to do that again sometime. With Asayoru. But, um... Who knows, maybe I'll be able to do, like, more, like, Phoebe pop-up events and stuff. Your schedule is a little packed at the moment, but when it starts to open up again, I'll be sure to let you know, Phoebe. Thank you, Asa! That would mean a lot to me. You do the guy voices so well, I completely forgot you were voicing them. <laughs> Thank you, that means a lot! I, I, I want to be able to do a convincingly good guy voice one day. You can see Elise's thoughts if you interact with the people again after talking with them. Oh! Thank you, Cyberpunk, for letting me know! Also, um, Yanos and Teacup Bun, thank you guys so much for the follows. Teacup Bun, hello! Welcome in, welcome in. I hope that you've been well. Phoebe Shonen voice pack release when? Well, I need to release, like, 
There's a bunch of other voice packs that I've made for you guys that I simply haven't released yet, because I didn't know, it, like, if Bandcamp was the right place to release it or not, or... What is this? Oh, this is like a... Water we or a windmill thing? Hmm. What a beautiful view! There she is! There she is, you guys! Um... I didn't realize... I was shocked to realize I wasn't following you despite following you on Twitter for years. No problem at all! Thank you so much for following me here as well, and I'm just happy to see you! I hope that you've been super well. One day I'll make it out to Asayoru. If you do anything for Anime Expo, Skiff, Milith... I definitely am gonna keep doing stuff for... SoCal Idol Fest and Northwest Idol Fest in the future. Um... Anime Expo really depends, but I really hope so. I've done it the past two years at least. Here we go! And there she is. Uh oh, oh my gosh. We're gonna lose bread. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Let's, let's eat first. Lady, thank you so much! I really appreciate it. Also, I hope you've been well. I really hope you've been well. I will, I will definitely poke you to catch up sometime. I will. Uh huh? How you been? Sekai no hate. Mm -hmm. Um, oh, thank you so much, Teacup Bun. I still have a lot more growth to go and a lot more dreams I want to make come true, but I'll keep working hard. There she is. Oh, let's, let's spend some time together. Elise! Ah, Elise! I'm so glad you made the time. I was curious about the maypole, I suppose. One moment... Ah, there you go. I was curious about the maypole, I suppose. Come now, I've been picking some flowers! Won't they wilt if you pick them now? Still playing with the colors. Papa's lending me a hand to dress the maple. And Mrs. Marielle. And Mrs. Linda, too. <laughs> Freya. Might as well invite all of Kieferberg to dress it at this rate. Oh, right. Why don't you help too, Elise? Me? You could spend the night on Friday, and we could do it all together. Uh, I'm not too certain. Spend the night, spend the night, spend the night, spend the night! Uh, it would be so much fun to have you. I'm not so good with that kind of thing, Freya. Uh, huh? Huh? Oh, it's wonderful! <laughs> I knew daisies would suit you the best. What do you say, Elise? Do you want to stay the night? Stay the night! Stay the night! Stay the night! Stay the night! I suppose I could, but... <laughs> it's alright if you don't want to, silly. That's not what I... <sighs> you don't fancy me much, do you, Elise? That's not true! That's not true! So sapphic. All I want is to be good friends with you. Despite everything. Despite everything? I guess they have a history. Wink wonk. Ooh. I do too, you know. <laughs> I wasn't trying to make you feel for me or anything of the sort. For goodness sake. That's not it, Freya. <gasps> oh, I didn't mean... I didn't even say anything yet. Oh, but I truly didn't mean to. For goodness sake! You're always overcompensating. It makes you seem disingenuous. Oh, please. Man. Uh, that's not what I was trying to do, but... And yes, I will be keeping this live stream up on YouTube. Indeed. <laughs> Forever. Hi, Mickey. I'm glad we're friends, Freya. I truly am. 
Yet you keep trying to please me day in, day out. That's not what I meant to do, Elise. I wish you'd treat me more as a friend, Freya. Rather than someone you owe an apology to. Elise. I'll be using that ointment you made me, alright? You know, you're a lavender scented Vix. <laughs> I never meant to overcompensate. For goodness sake. Yet you shower me with gifts every day of the week. Well, there's a reason why I do that. It's because I love you, Elise. You don't do that to anyone else. What am I supposed to think? I know. But... That's because I care for you, Elise. Baka. Uh, uh-huh. <laughs> There's a reason why you're the only one, silly. Oh my gosh! Same brain with Freya, actually? Actually? Anyhow, it's getting quite late, isn't it? <laughs> Is everything all right, Elise? You're as red as a beet. <laughs> Why? It is getting quite late. <laughs> <laughs> What are you laughing at? See you later, Elise. See you around town, Elise. For goodness sake. Ah, our very first heart piece, and it's with Freya. Yay! She's so red. She was so red. Oh my gosh. <laughs> ah, these two are so heckin' cute. I cannot, I cannot believe it. Oh, like I, I legitimately, legitimately ship. <laughs> Unlucky me, I'm so glad, I'm so glad. Also, uh, baby doll's heart. Unlucky me, thank you guys so much for popping in. Welcome, welcome. The matching complimentary colors, indeed. I would like to fill the entire locket with Freya Emeralds. I will do that for you, Wild Inventor. We will make that dream come true together. Romantic dates. You'll get a love heart after every successful date. Oh wow, we really passed a lot of time with Freya. It's even more pretty. During sunset. Get married already. We're gonna make that happen. Goodness knows what I would give to live in a castle just like that one. Oh! So we're in a kingdom. Yet yeah, here I am. A simple maid of all work. I mean, that means you're extra, extra talented, right? At last! Thank you so much for the follow! Welcome in! How are you? Thank you so... By the way, at last, I was so... So happy I finally saw your, uh... Notification that I get to sing on your idol song. Thank you so much for the opportunity. Yes, so if... By the way, if anybody wants me to wants to collabor collaborate with me, have me sing on your original song. We can talk about um, commissions or collaborations. I just love bringing people's songs to life with my voice. I really love to. Get pregante, Freya. Oh my gosh, does that does it work like that? Well, actually, yeah, sure. When two people love each other very much, they kiss and then and then uh, the stork brings them a baby. Is this your first time playing the game? It is Cosmic Cotton, it is! Also, welcome in! <laughs> Yuri Preg? <laughs> Al Babi. Yes, a stork. The stork brings it. Remember Stork is on? I talked about this on stream before. Stork is on. Oh, yes. Uh, Rosin Marine wants to meet at the backyard. Yes, that is how Babby is formed. Indeed, indeed. <laughs> the loading screen looks like Elise is farting out a stream of flowers. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna be able to unsee that. <laughs> okay, let's save. Just in case we want to rewatch that, I'm gonna save into a new save file. There you go. Uh -huh. Oh, 
why she's in the backyard, right? There's Flock. Hi, Flock! Hi, baby. Can we pet him yet? There you are, Flock. Ought to be nice being a goat, huh? Not one care in the world. Oblivious to everything. Where do storks get the babies from? Are they isekai from somewhere else? Well, um, the power of love drifts on the wind to a field full of flowers. And when the flowers blossom, there's a little baby in the middle. And then the storks pick up the pick up the babies from the middle of the flowers, and then that's where the babies come from. I'm doing fine, by the way. Um, let's see. Uh, I need a break from all the work and saw you streaming, so thought I'd watch. Ah, thank you so much for popping in. Hope you have a cozy time. Yes, gotta make all the rewatch saves. God, I'm gonna make a rewatch save after every day, or before before every day, before every day. Also, hi Matt, how you doing? Where do stork babies come from then? Flowers? So I guess the real question is what came first? The stork or the egg? One of those things was the very first thing is in existence. What about twins? Do you get two flowers? Well, have you ever seen flowers that have multiple buds on them? It's probably like that. There she is. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, uh, we'll eat bread after this. We should be okay running on one bread. I'll spend some time with her. What about flower babies? Rosemarine! She sounds so mad at her. There you are, Rosmarine. Elise. I didn't know you'd be back so soon, Elise. Hmm. I still ought to head back to town, mind you. I mean, we could be working at this time, but I really wanted to see this date. Whatever dates I can do, while still fitting in all of Freya's dates, I will do. Yeah, two storks, probably. What are you doing standing out here? I mean, isn't it obvious she's looking at the beautiful sunset? <laughs> oh, just waiting for the stars to come out is all. Hmm. A little too early for stars, don't you think? I find it helps me air out my thoughts. Hmm. Air out your thoughts, you say? I'm waiting for the waxing crescent. It's... Important I set my sight on what's to come. The sooner the better. What do you mean, Rosmarine? Oh, that's... You see, Elise. I've dreamt about you before. About Kieferberg, too. How romantic! Well, like, well, I saw you in my... Uh, like, um... Where have I seen you before? Oh, that's right, in my dreams. Oh my gosh. Also, hi, Kill. Thank you so much for popping in to help with modding. Thank you. Yeah, Elise is always mad. <laughs> for goodness sake! <laughs> I feel like I need to add more mad into my Elise voice. Last night, or... I know this may sound strange, but... I didn't quite stumble upon Kieferberg by accident. Marine. What do you mean? Do you believe in fate, Elise? I did after I met Freya. Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. I don't know. I have never given it much thought. Mm. Then you most likely won't believe what I have to say. But it's fate, Elise. I've always known my fate was with you, Elise. Eh? I can't get in the way of fate, can I? Now I feel bad! Now I feel bad! <gasps> huh? It's too soon to be having this conversation, if I'm honest. I meant to wait until you were ready, but... What does that mean? Oh my gosh! <laughs> wait until she's ready? Ready for what? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank you so much for the Kofi donation, Jabber. I really appreciate it. Thank you. I don't understand, Ro Rosmarine. She's still calling her, calling her Rosmarine after all this time. I don't understand, Rosmarine. Ready for what? You'll know in time. For goodness sake! What's with all this mystery? Out with it, Rosmarine. What are you trying to tell me? It took me quite some time to make sense of it myself, but oh 
beautiful. Everything's feeling so strange and nostalgic to me. Hmm. Nostalgic, you say? Oh, that's... Your name? Your voice? Your home? This breeze, even. All that surrounds you. So much of it feels like home to me. Ah, oh, they're so cute! I have two hands. Or rather, Elise has two hands. One for Rosmarine. Rosenmarine! Oh my gosh, now I'm calling her Rosmarine too. One for Rosenmarine and one for Freya. You're so right. You're so right. That's not possible, Rosmarine. Elise. It's you the stars told me about, Elise. I'm certain now. Never in my life have I ever heard such nonsense, and yet... I'm covered in goosebumps. <laughs> I can tell you don't believe one word of what I just said. Rosemarine. I... I think I'll stay out here for a little while longer. If that's alright. <laughs> I promise I won't be late for supper. Alright. Don't stay out here too long, you hear? Gotta make yes. me dinner. <laughs> I won't, I won't. Oh, that was actually so super cute. And yeah, this is basically a Yuri dating sim, but with horror, horror elements, too. So it's a horror game, and also a, uh... Also a, uh, Yuri visual novel. Mm -hmm. What about Love Cool Hand? I love Love Cool Hand, too. Oh my god. Oh, we need bread. Oh, oh we need bread. Oh, blah, 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 blah. Um, let's go to town. Oh, yeah. Love Kuhan wanted me to go... Yeah, say hi to her. The horror is when you're starving to death constantly. I've, uh... <laughs> I have felt that somewhat recently. But, um, luckily not to death. Luckily not to death. Hehe, <laughs> yes. All the love interests are gorals. Okay, let's save here. Have I eaten? <laughs> I will eat after this, I promise. I'm gonna find myself something healthy that, that's not Taco Bell to eat. Okay, let's go back to town. I think it's this way. I have a horrible sense of direction, but I think I remember the way now. This is the way. Don't forget your lantern. Oh, you're right. How do I turn that on again? Is it... L? No. D? F? Q. S? Oh my gosh. Left control. Oh, left control. There you go. Thank you. Taco Bell is healthy, trust. It's only healthy... ...for my happiness. <laughs> for my mental health. I wish this game actually filled our bread slots when we have dinner. It doesn't?! <gasps> what the heck are we eating? Air? There's Lab. There you are, Lab Kuhan. You're a little too happy to see me, aren't you? Oh, I thought today would never end, that's all. You do look tired, Elise. These folks will be the death of me, that's what. Fretting over this witch nonsense day in, day out. Day in and day out. You know they're rather superstitious, Elise. Oh, you're buying into it now, too? What's next? We all sleep in the church together like chickens in a coop? Please. <laughs> it's all nonsense, Leb. Everyone's losing their wits. Here's your bread, Elise. Oh, two bread? Thank you. I owe you my life. You guys know that meme with the like alpaca thing eating out of the person's hand? And it's like, I owe you my life. <laughs> Did you make too much today or something? I felt you could use a little more than usual tonight. Huh? Does she know? Does she know about Roz? Oh. 
Did you miss Riz? You did. Did you see the one I gave Chisa? Oh, bread? Wait, what did you give to Chisa? <gasps> you need to look after yourself, Elise. Yeah, pack a meme. Oh! You gave that to... That was you? <laughs> that, that's so good. I love it so much. I have cool hands always had a talent to figure things out, but... Is this her intuition again, or...? Move along, Elise, before it gets late. I... I'll see you tomorrow, Leb. Bread giver is life giver, truly. Remember that mysterious note? Oh, yeah. Hmm. Who will you end up with? The girl that constantly gifts you and craves your company? The girl that dreams about you and believes meeting you was destiny? Or the girl that gives you two whole breads? Oh, man. How could I say no to the two whole breads? Just kidding. It's gotta... We're, we're going for Freya's route no matter what. We're going for Freya's route no matter what. But Kuhan was a bit ghostly in that light. It is a little bit sus Like, she is being a little sus right now. Like, how'd she know I needed two breads? How'd she know? I will, I guess. I will save one of the breads for... Roz and Maureen. Freya better learn to make that bread. I'm sure she could. Maybe. I don't know. We'll see. Okay, let's save here. Before we progress. Down. Hello? What's for dinner? What's cooking, good looking? Elise. Welcome back. I brought some bread. Let's settle down and eat. Young dead vibes. She knows you've risen on two girls. <laughs> But she's given me bread to feed one of them, so I can continue to riz them. Would you like me to start making dinner for us from tomorrow, Elise? Wow, she's going the waifu route already? She's like, would you like dinner? A bath? Or maybe... To get eaten by the witch? Hmm. Oh, God. That's not a bad idea in itself, but... But, but like, what? What are we gonna... What are you gonna cook? We got no food. How am I to know you won't make a mess of it? Last thing I want is to spend my evenings in the outhouse. Oh. <laughs> I'll have you know I'm a proper cook, Elise. Never once did my sweet granny disapprove of anything I prepared. <sighs> yeah, I bet she cooks grass, just like in, uh, Cult of the Lamb. Mm-hmm. Or like, Dong. Well, I suppose it can't do much harm. All right. On that note, Rosmarine, you're to sleep up in the attic from now on. Can't have you hanging around the granary and bringing all the dust and cobwebs inside. That was a granary? That was the most nasty granary ever. <gasps> Thank you so much, Rod and Av, for the... Did you guys come together or separate? Oh my gosh. I got a bat raid and a rat raid at the same time. Bat raid, brat raid? Wait, I got a bat raid and a rat raid. Oh, it's a... Dub, oh, you guys came together? Wah! Two people I love were streaming together! Wah! Welcome in, welcome in. We are currently streaming a game that I got to voice act in. And, uh, we just did a romance event with our character. Yeah, and we're voice acting the whole thing as well. Everybody, please go give Rat and Av lots and lots of love. Um... Those of you guys that are new here, welcome in. I am Phoebe. I'm your 2.5D fairy tale idol that loves to write and sing my own original songs in both English and in Japanese on the IRL and the virtual stage. And um, in addition to being an idol, I also do voice acting. And this was my very, very first big role in a game. So I'm really, really excited to do um, weekly streams playing through Freya's route together on both Twitch and on YouTube. So, uh, for you YouTube people, we just got two raids on Twitch right now. Since you cannot see that. Um, but thank you so much for being here. I really, really appreciate it. And, um, I hope you had a wonderful stream. What did you guys do? Psycho Ruby Gamer, thank you for the follow. Well, um, um, Rat, thank you so much for resubscribing for three months. Welcome back to the Beehive. 
You finish it takes two to get it. Oh, I love it takes two. I love it takes two. I hope you had a wonderful time. Also, authentic Inari Fox, thank you so much for the follow. I thought you were already following, but welcome in, welcome in. Oh my gosh, what did you guys think of it takes two? And also, did Cutie the Elephant make you cry? Because <laughs> I cried so heckin' hard when I played it with Iku. Oh my god. That was... that was wild. Yeah, oh my god, it was so evil. Oh, but I... Same Joga! Ah, take care, Matt! Thank you for being here, Oyasubi! We cried and yelled so much. I bet! God, I have to go back and watch that sometime. I have to... I want to watch you guys. Spe you, like, specifically you guys playing through that scene. It was, wasn't it, Aramis? Oh, I can clean it out for you, Elise. It's really no trouble. I've had my fill of running about looking for you day and night. But... Oh, Elise, I wouldn't want to be a bother. I mean, we're not using the attic right now, so... Oh, shush it! And I wouldn't want you nesting with the mice and the geckos. You're sleeping in the attic, and that's final. You hear? I'm letting you sleep inside where it's perfectly warm, and... Did you... Did you hear that, Rosemary? I, wait, I didn't hear it. What was it? What did you hear? What did you hear? Hear what? I'm taking the broom. You stay here, just in case. Ugh. What? 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 I'm scared. Well, yeah, how have you been, Inari? Uh. Nice, Ali's voice. Thank you. Yep, it's gonna start being scary game. Or at least this time of night. Yeah, evening is the scary time of night. So what are we investigating exactly? Oh! Oh my god, what, the, what is that? That... Muffy? Mandy! Muffy? It's you! Aw, oh, great. Did she catch Rosmarine? I mean... I see, no, I'm calling her Rosmarine. Ros Rosenmarine. Eee! Please spare me, Elise! Muffy! What in the Lord's name are you doing here, Miffy? Isn't it, like, super, like, windy and stormy and it, this is in the mountains? What are you doing here, kid? I like how her tears are not darkened, but the rest of her portrait is. <laughs> Uh, you know... Uh, I was out on a stroll, I swear! Uh, I swear on my auntie's name! That's so. Ah, and you just so happened to hide behind my house, I see. Uh, who does it? You sneak about folks' homes every now and then too, don't you? No? Who does that? Uh. What are you doing here, Mandy? <laughs> Tell me right now, or I'll scrub your mouth with soap this very minute. It's getting quite late, isn't it, Elise? I best... Out with it! I... I saw her! That girl you're housing, Elise! Mm -hmm. You saw nothing, Molly. <laughs> she, she's not from around here. Even I can tell. Uh... You are having supper together and everything, Elise. Uh -huh. You keep your mouth shut, Mubby. <laughs> Yeah, why did she come all the way out here? Why? Maybe she saw... You know what? My theory is that she saw Lep Kuhen give me two breads and she wanted the second one. You keep your mouth shut, Mubby, or I'll... <laughs> well, why don't you share some of that bread you've got, Elise? I might keep quiet if you do. For goodness sake! Oh, I should have guessed that's what you wanted. I knew it! <sighs> what are you telling him, Miffy? You'd better get me a pretzel tomorrow. What? So she's gonna keep blackmailing me? I have to buy her food every day? So my food fund, from all the all the chores I do around town, is to placate Muffy. Extortion. Extortion! How dare! Muffy's my favorite variation too, for sure. <laughs> Mouth shut, or I'll make certain you'll never go for a stroll again. <coughs> Why'd you say that, Elise? What the heck? Oh 
My gosh. And don't come back, or else. For goodness sake. This is the last thing I needed. I'm sorry, I... Is she gone? Mm. This could be bad, Rosmarine. I'm sorry. Oh, Elise, I genuinely hadn't seen her. I would have told you if I had. Uh -huh. Don't you start fretting now, too. Do you think she'll tell anyone? Also, take care, Wild Inventor. Thank you so much for hanging out with us today. Oyasubi! I'll see you next time, alright? Uh, yeah, these are gonna be on Fridays from now on, by the way. Mm -hmm. So, same, same day, same time as it was today. Do you think she'll tell anyone? Mm -hmm. If she does, we could be... ...in trouble. I know, Rosmarine. Wouldn't it be easier to just be honest with the... ...with the townsfolk about it? Just, like, bring her in and, like, introduce her and stuff? Instead of, like, hiding it and then, like, being questioned later on why we were hiding it? Isn't that more sus? I'm sorry, I... It's Rosmarine. It's Rosenmarine. Shush it, you! Oh, shush. I'm heading back inside. Oh my gosh! She tried to correct you! Uh, Is she gonna say yes. it properly from now on now, or...? Uh, yes. <laughs> You're right, she is emotionally constipated, that is true. Oh god, really? Ugh, oh, I have to have food for Moppet? Ugh. Oh. Elise. I'm heading off to bed, Rosmarine. Oh, she's still staring like that! I could spend the night in the granary if you'd like. No, I meant what I said. You're sleeping in the attic. I'll meet you upstairs. Uh, all right. Mindy's dangerous. I ought to be careful. Yeah. None of that muffin. Hi, Evil King Yuan! Hello, hello! I've missed you. How have you been? I am playing Little Goody Two Shoes. It is a new horror game. Horror romance RPG that I got to be a voice actress in for both the English and the Japanese version. It blows my mind how suspicious townspeople are, apparently are, of outsiders. Is this normal even for the Middle Ages? I don't know! Cause like, in like... Games and in... Shows and stuff, don't you see like, random travelers popping in every now and then? Like, merchants and... Like, she could be a merchant! Though, she doesn't really have anything. You left that goat in the granary, I'm hoping? Of course! <laughs> I left the door ajar so he can go out and about if he wants. What makes you think he'll stay put? <laughs> Why, the bed I made him, of course. You ought to see it, Elise. <laughs> I am not going out of my way to see a goat's hay bed, Rosmarine. Up you go. You need to make your bed, too. So many things in this game are period accurate, so I assume it might be normal. That's... that might be true, actually. They did a lot of research to make it period accurate. I'm still surprised you had to voice Freya in both languages. Yeah, it was very... They wanted to make sure that the cast could, um, could be bilingual, and... I'm really, really happy that I got that opportunity to do so. You'll make do, I'm certain. Oh, it's perfect! I'll get you a blanket, too. I can't have you sleeping on hay. Why not? For goodness sake. You're not a goat, Rosmarine. <laughs> I could be a thief, yet you're trusting me with a blanket? For goodness sake. I don't see what's so funny. I mean, if, I, if I'm not using the blanket, then, like... You truly are kind, Elise. I can see that clearly now. Shush it, you. Uh, take cow, Outlast! And take cow? Take care, Outlast! <laughs> Thank you so much for hanging out, and I hope that you enjoy the game if you get it. Oh, yeah, Sylvie. I'll talk to you later. Oh, shush. I'll be glad to take that blanket, Elise. I'll get you some matches, too. And a candy. <laughs> Thank you, Elise. It's bedtime now. I need some rest. Good night, Rosmarine. Mm -hmm. Good night, Elise. Rosmarine! No, I'm gonna keep calling her that from now on! Rosenmarine. Rosenmarine. Wow, what a pretty CG. Look at her bed here. For goodness sake. What am I getting myself into? First, I agreed to house Rosmarine. 
Now Miffy's caught wind of it too. Yes, yeah, Super Muffin. I best make sense of this all by tomorrow. Yeah, you know, for being poor, she has some really comfy looking bed sheets and pillow. But only I could leave this town. Oh, somewhere far, far away from here. A place where I'd never have to fret about money or going hungry. Like a castle or a palace. Somewhere. Where I can live the life I deserve. <sighs> oh, oh god. Why it look like that? Why it look like that? Uh... Oh! Speak of the devil. A castle. Where... am I? What... is this? Is this a dream? I mean, probably. <gasps> we did go to sleep. And there's no way that we just walked here, so... <laughs> uh, hello? Oh, shoot. I am very hungry. Uh, let's have a bread. And a bread. What's this sparkly thing? What? Rebirth. That's what I wished for. Long, long ago. You wanted to be... reborn? Somewhere safe. Somewhere far, far away. I went through all of their trials. Gathered all of his gifts. And? Indeed, I was reborn. My wish was granted, yet... Yet? To think I would end up like this... Wait! What was that? Oh. Oh, she gave me grapes! And, uh... Lowered my sanity. What the heck? Do grapes heal your sanity? Is that what it does? What heals sanity? Well, I don't have any... Any items that can do that. Yeah, free grapes, though. I love when ghosts randomly give me grapes. Whips. Whips. It's locked, it seems. Oh, and I bet there's something nice inside, too. Can I, like, maybe, like... Kick it open, or, like... No? Okay. Ooh, what a fancy schmancy bed! Oh, what I would give to sleep here every night! Spacious bed stands in the corner. Ah, oh, it's beauty! Mirrors are scary. I feel like I'm in a princess's bedroom! If only I could live here. Just like I've always dreamed. <gasps> ah! Ow, what the heck?! Uh... There are all sorts of dangers lurking in the shadows. Use healing items. Okay. What is that? Oh, a key. Oh! Can I use it on this chest? The items in your inventory have effects on the environment. Oh, does it not work? Also, hi, Atori! Welcome in! How you doing? Do I have to use it from the inventory? Oh, I do. Let's see... Oh, goodness! So many dresses! Another key? I wonder what it's for. Can we, like, put on the dresses? Can we play dress-up now? No, Elise, you don't want to live here. Do we not want to live here? With the dresses? I'm locked in here, I suppose. Can't say I minded much, if I'm honest. No, you're not! You have a key! Look at your picture of Freya for comfort in the relationship menu. Oh, you right! <gasps> Such a long corridor. <sighs> it truly feels as though I'm inside a palace. 
Well, this is what she's always wanted. Wait, we have suspicion now. Oh my god! Huh? Why is Rosin Marine covered in blood? And why Freya have a bloody sickle? Live cool him, you two! That's not very none of you. Oh, shoot. Uh. Yeah, let's uh. Ooh. And maybe they were making stuff with strawberry jam. <laughs> Such a strange statue. Marble statue of a serpent wearing a golden crown. Its nameplate reads Aziel. Isn't that like a demon's name? Its nameplate reads. I don't know how to read that. <laughs> None of you will make it out safely, but don't. <laughs> oh, okay, let's save here. Oh boy. They're making pasta. You speak Murloc? Yeah. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. I have a bad feeling about this. Ha <laughs> <laughs> We're in danger! <laughs> We're in danger! Oh. Oh. What is this? What in the Lord's name is this place? What are those... things? What things? Oh. Those things. Right. Lantern... on. What is... Ooh, no, I, I feel like I shouldn't let it touch me. Oh, what's this? These are all in a different language. I can't make sense of these titles. Oh, <laughs> wow, look, it's a danger. Ooh, what's that? It's sparkly! Sparkle, sparkle. What? Huh? No, no, no. Ow! Shoot! Oh, God. No! I'm trying to pick up this thing. There you go. Bandages. Oh, thank you. It knew that I was going to be getting hurt. That's... me? Oh, that's a portrait of her? Look at this photograph. Every time I look, it makes me laugh. It's jammed. I could try to pry it open, but... Maybe it'll deplete in my health, but I feel like we gotta get it open. Oh, no, it worked. What's that? What's this? The key to one's dream is found within oneself. As for yours, it's in this very room. The core of your innermost desire. It's not knowledge you seek, but gold-bathed glory. Okay... So I guess the knowledge would... Oh! I guess the knowledge would have to deal with the books on the shelves. But they don't want me to look at the books on the shelves, because it's not knowledge I seek. Ah! No, 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 did I find it? Oh. No, 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 no. Okay, if I run fast enough, it can't get me. Four keyholes. Oh, then I got one. I got one of the four keys. Oh. Okay, this one looks a little different than the other ones. There's something on the back of the shelf. I have to reach out my arm to get it, but... Reach for the stars! This is... Oh, I got it. Okay, two more keys. It's a key. Okay, two more keys. New objective, escape the room. That wasn't an obje objective before? Of course I want to escape the room. Uh, that key! 
Okay. It's no wonder they welted being left in such an awful room. Bunch of purple flowers sag lazily over their vase. Where could the other one be? Oh no 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 does this game have a Twitter? Yes! Um, Astral Shift Pro. So you have to look at the Twitter of the game devs. Wah, wah, wah. Four keyholes. That means there's four keys I'd wager. Yes. Oh no! I thought that like... Opening the door could get me out of this. Can I use all of them at once? This is it! And this is it! <laughs> oh, thank you, Joga. Thank you. It worked! There you go. Saved myself. This is your home now. Why would you want to leave? Uh, maybe if my home didn't have things that depleted my health? What is this? Where am I? I must be dreaming. Well, duh! You would think so up until this point. Oh? Oh. Is that... That's the castle! That you can see from Kieferberg! Huh. Maybe the torch monsters are nice once you get to know them. You know... Maybe I should have given them a chance. Oh, hello! Hurry now, hurry now! We're late for his banquet. What... are you? Hurry, hurry! Pooh's banquet! <laughs> it's so cute! Let's chase after it! Ooh! <laughs> pumpkin! A pumpkin! Pumpkin! <gasps> Whoa! I love the OST here, too! Uh, they're so cute! Oh my gosh! Yeah, it suddenly became Nightmare Before Christmas. Ah. <laughs> I'm so happy you're having fun, Bree. A dream? <sighs> that left me feeling a little queasy. Well, we're back. Rosemarine? Pumpkin charms! Rosmarine? Are you there? She's most likely still asleep anyway. Mm. No point in waking her this early, I suppose. Well, what's over here? Collected fireflies, one. Oh, you can collect fireflies? Oh my god, I opened the closet from behind the closet. This could have been a good game to play on Spooky Month. I wanted to play it on Spooky Month, but I was very sick. It did come out on Halloween after all. Oh, I guess... I guess you couldn't have really played it during the month of Spooky Month because it came out on Halloween. So much for St. Walpurga's protection. I ought to have thrown you out long ago, Lassie. Palms Ruin and Prayer, the wooden statue of St. Walpurga, grants protection to the faithful. La la la. Elise. Good morning, Elise. I would have got a head start on breakfast if I knew you'd be waking up this early. For goodness sake. Since when have you been up? Oh, I'm always up and about before daybreak. I can't sleep in if I try. I didn't notice you coming down from the attic. I brought the ladder up with me last night so it wouldn't wake you. And the hatch doesn't squeak if you do it slowly, right? I 
took my shoes off and used the ladder to shut it back up. Easy. Wow, so basically you're really good at sneaking around. Sus. <laughs> you're smarter than you look, huh? <laughs> I don't look as smart as I am, Elise. Is that so? Wow, Elise, you're mean! What the heck? You're saying she looks dumb? Anyhow, I'm heading off to the garden. The garden? You mean the field just outside? Is it that obvious that I haven't touched it in years? Been working like a dog since Granny Hall passed. Granny Holly? Hall? Hall? Holly? Granny Holly passed, but. Now that I have you to fret about, too, I can't just sit on my hands forever, can I? <laughs> what? You'd rather starve? Join me as a maid of all work, perhaps? <laughs> you truly are kind, aren't you? Shush it, you. Oh, shush. I'm heading out to see what I can do about the garden. Do I get to start farming soon? That'd make me happy. I'll call you in for breakfast in a moment, then. What was that? Uh, bread? Just a random bread on the floor? Uh, for goodness sake. Oh, is Joga headed out? Oh. Well, oh, yeah, Subi! Oh, yeah, Subi! Take care! Thank you so much for being here, Joga! For goodness sake! I need some water, hold on. You think an E at the end of German words are pronounced with an A uh sound, so holla? Oh my gosh, holla! <laughs> I've neglected it for so long, it'll be impossible to dig. Maybe we start to, we get to start farming. Anyhow, this is no time to loiter about. Time to start planting carrots and potatoes and carrots and potatoes and carrots and potatoes, because those are my favorite veggies. Yeah? A pair of shoes? How could they possibly have wound up here in my garden? Wait, did she dig this up or? They're wonderful! Aww. And they fit me like a glove too! These shoes. As though they were made for me! Wow. I did it! All of Kieferberg needs to hear about this! <laughs> wow! Oh? An Eizo Jo-sama? Is that Freya being a maid? Oh my god! This whole thing is so amazing! The graphics, the music... Diana singing... among the maids, because obviously she wants to see Freya in a maid outfit. It's obvious. Eh? Eh? What just happened? What's going on? 
On your feet, Elise. It certainly felt like a whimsy land kind of tune, didn't it? But, uh, what the heck is happening here? Explain yourself. Oh, what, are they sussy of my shoes, or...? What is there to explain, father? Could you not hear yourself, lass? Oh god, it's old Jockin. It was a canonical music musical number, I guess. Like it actually happened, not just in her head. <laughs> Parading into Walpurga, seeing Walpurga's place of worship, howling and shouting like a... Please, old Jockin. Words of egotism, vanity, disdain for your fellow folk. I've always known you were wicked, you arrogant lassie! You old geezer! Why, you? A witch! A witch of old Hall's kin! Huh? I am not a witch, what? You. Oh, listen here, you old wretch! That's enough! Old Jockin has overstepped his boundaries. I ask that you pardon him. Yet his concerns weigh heavy, Elise. <laughs> Oh, I wasn't aware singing and dancing was forbidden now, father. <sighs> Your singing was riddled with sin, lass. The sin of... of wanting to not be poor? Huh? Vanity and l lust. Lust? Ah, so it was because she wanted to see Freya in a maid outfit. <laughs> lust? Lust? Oh my. Oh, shush it! What does any of this have to do with sin, father? This old geezer just accused me and my grandmother of witchery, yet... <sighs> Enough, Elise. Compose yourself and come inside. Your temperament is a sin in and of itself. Ugh. Why? If this will allow me to explain myself... <laughs> I guess I'll repent for something I didn't do, if it makes you happy. <sighs> Yet, there's something I'd like to make clear to you all. You've stood witness to this foolery. You've all heard old Jock and accuse me of witchery. That's enough, Elise. You asked me to pardon him yourself, Father, and I will. Yet I demand you folks understand this once and for all. Out with it! I am not a mere maid of all work. I am one of you. And I demand right here, right now, that you start treating me as such. Very well, Elise. You made yourself heard. Well, I hope they start treating her nice. Don't tell a priest to shut up unless you mean old Jockin. I think she means old Jockin. I, I hope she means old Jockin. That's just gonna make everybody else... ...sussy if, uh... ...otherwise. What the heck is happening? Without a shadow of a doubt, lass. At last, he's made his move. Who are you? An old acquaintance of yours, lass. Of mine? I don't know you. What? You're favored by him, Elise. Rightfully so. You're clad in his will from head to toe, inside out. And those shoes... My... shoes? Those very shoes, Elise, are a testament of his gift to you. Who is he? Listen carefully now, my beautiful lass. <sighs> Get away from me! Yours is his heritage, his flesh. His ardor. Don't you understand, Elise? What in the Lord's name? How do you know my name? His blessings. His will. He himself is writhing in your veins, lass. What do you want from me, you old hag? You must listen carefully now, my beloved. Do as I say, and he will make all your wishes come true. What is this? My... wishes, you say? Why, yes. Opulence, splendor, fortune. Your deepest desire is unlike any other Elise. I don't... understand. Well, she says that, but I'm pretty sure a lot of people have wanted to be rich in the past, but whatever. 
You do, Elise. Tell me, what is it you most desire? Me? Speak it, Elise. What I most desire, that's... Freya in a maid outfit! Fortune. Fortunate you are, Elise. Okay, what the heck was that? Deep in this woodland, there is a patron saint. Whose blissful word bestows a blessing upon the faithful. All that's requested in return are three gifts made from the testaments to one's desire. Reach his dwelling with all of these in hand, and your wish shall be granted. A womb, carrier of life. Your basket is to hold all that is sacred. Oh gosh, the sound design is just so crunchy and good. The tender flesh of earthly desire. The sweetest nectar to be drunk in earnest. You are to arrive in good company, the object of your affections. You are to reach the gates of his dwelling, carrying all three gifts. But I don't want the object of my affection to be a gift. She's mine! Freya in the maid outfit belongs only to Elise. I'm sure Freya would love to do a maid ex or jewel summer roleplay with Elise. I'm... Dude, once they get married, I'm sure they do. I'm sure they do. <laughs> Voice your innermost desire. Surrender yourself wholly to his grace. I own Freya? You mean I'm owned by Elite? That's what you mean. And fortune you shall attain. For such is his blessing, and such is your desire. Yeah, the drawings are so wonderful. I am just such a fan. <laughs> of, oh, sorry, my bad. My bad, sorry. Elise, are you listening? Where did she go? Elise. Oh, are you all right, Elise? Where did that old hag go? Elise? What's the matter with you? Leb Oh, I'm... I'm sorry, Leb. It's best we let her rest a while. We can sit with you, Elise. Oh, it's it's best we give her some space, Jacob. Uh... I'm all right. I I felt a little dizzy. Is all. Hmm. I can bring you some water, Elise. <laughs> As for me, I'll be in church waiting to have a word with you. Don't you start, Lab. Oh, I've already started. My, now you've done it, Elise. Uh... For goodness' sake. Oh no, we're gonna get ratted out by our childhood friend. Hi, Sass, how you doing? How unreal is the art in this game? I know, right? It's so wonderful. Or as a, as Freya would say it, um... Oh, it's wonderful! Something like that. <laughs> oh god, I'm so hungry. I love how the music gets all distorted too. <laughs> <laughs> hey, um... Let's eat this bread. And these grapes. Let's go buy some bread, actually. Oh yeah, I do need a pretzel for the, bri the bride. That's why I'm holding on to this one. Aha, there's... there's Muffy. Good day, ma'am. 
I was... I was helping Granny Gretel. Oh, you can't expect me to believe that. Also, hi, Kagewa. Good to see you. It's true. Uh, I promise uh, on my auntie's life. Helping her with what, then? Granny Gretel gives me b bread whenever I come visit. You, you see? Sh she asked me to taste all the pies for the festival. Is that so? Wow, what a nice job. <laughs> um, yep. Tis I, Frey I. It, it is so. It really is so, Elise. You'd best not try Granny Gretel's patience, Mandy. She's too old for that. It, it's Muffy. Miffy, Molly, Mubby, it's all the same to me. It's not that silly of a name. I do feel bad for whoever named her Muffy, though. When I think Muffy, I think, uh... What's the... What's the show again? Um, Arthur? Hey, Arthur? It's always lovely seeing you, Elise. Look how little she is! I wonder if that means that Lebkuhan's gonna become that little when she's an old person as well. What ya buying? What ya selling? Ooh, plus three bread. That's pretty nice. Let's buy some of that. Let's get ourselves some more bread. There you go. See you, Granny. Oh, I mean, I feel bad for Muffy, not the one who named her. But I don't know, maybe I also feel bad for the one who named her. To have a grubby little child like her. She's cute, though. I love her. She's kind of... She's honestly really adorable. Hi, guys. What's up? I'm one of the boys. Hard at work in those shoes, are you? They hardly make a difference, Mr. Guido. Come now, lads. We ought to get to the logging camp. Getting that maypole done in one day won't be an easy task. I must say, I'm not confident either. All we need is a little cheer, lad. Let's get the townsfolk feeling jolly again. He's like Santa Claus! Confirmed. Freya's dad is Santa Claus. <sighs> Hi, Jojo! Hey, Phoebe. Hope you're doing good, and I hope you're having a speedy recovery. Thank you! I'm, I'm actually fully recovered now, I'd like to say. Mm-hmm. Now I just gotta get back into the hang of practicing my singing again. And, uh, getting my voice back in condition. Having so much fun watching you play this full, but I gotta play D&D now. Hope you have heaps of fun. <gasps> have fun playing D&D, Namu! Oyasubi! See. But, uh, thank you for popping in, Jojo. Muffy's theme sounds like something out of Earthbound a bit. It did, didn't it, huh? There's no shortage of joy in this last, that's for certain. We all saw you twirling about the village square, Elise. Never imagined you could sing. Oh, that wasn't... Way to keep up the cheerful mood, lass. That's precisely what Kieferberg needs most this week. I suppose... Keep that in mind, Elise. You must share more of that song and dance, you hear? Aw, that's nice. See, Freya's dad is so nice to us. What's in here? Can we go in here? No? No? Wait. <laughs> I saw your Twitter and did see your cancelled Anime Expo Chibi announcement, which I want to say you're always welcome to Anime Expo Chibi. Thank you. They did tell me that they would that they would really they'd be really really happy to have me back next time. So hopefully I'll be able to do next year's Anime Expo and Anime Expo TV. Well, thank you so much for the super chat, Hot Cyberpunk. I really appreciate it. Now let me go ahead and uh, hydrate real quick. Welcome back, Tempest! And thank you, Aishiza! Wow, I'm just using a bunch of different save files. That's because I want to rewatch certain scenes. Hello? Ah, oh, there you are, Elise. Oh, old Jockin truly went too far. I suppose. There's no need to hold your tongue, lass. That was far from reasonable. Nobody agrees with him. Oh, that's good. That's good. 
I'm actually going to Anime NYC this Sunday. See, I was going to try to go to Anime NYC as well, but I have a friend's wedding to go to this Sunday. So, um, I decided against it. Mm -hmm. Also, thank you so much, Ruby and Tony Reggio, for the follows. Welcome to the Beehive. Um, but yeah, have lots and lots of fun for me too, alright? You gotta have double the fun. Enough for you and enough for me. Um, I suppose there comes a time when older folks lose their minds. Well, if you guys have particular conventions that you want to see me perform and be a guest at, then please, please, like, send my website and send, like, an email to your local conventions and they, they like receiving, like, recommendations for guests and all of that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, not only am I going to the wedding, but I'm gonna be a bridesmaid in the wedding as well. They're my besties. Pumpkin! Pumpkin's getting married. Oh, uh, I'm listening to the stream while working on some work. Ah, nice, nice. Now, that's a different story, Marielle. Would it be okay for non-NA conventions like in C? Yes! Yes, please! All over the world! I would love to come to Southeast Asia one day. There's no story, Lud Ludwig. Elise was singing and dancing, so what? Truly, old Jockin's outburst was rather distasteful. But I have been meaning to ask where you got those shoes, Elise. Oh, they are... You don't have to tell us, Elise. You're right about what you said. We all should be treating you with a little bit more respect. Oh? I'm so glad they're listening to her. I loved your performance as Freya, so I'm super happy to be able to listen to you play the game. Uh, thank you, Ruby. That means a lot to me. Thank you, thank you. And also, good luck with your work. I'm cheering you on. Freya's cheering you on, too. Though you li literally only know one here. I mean, that's the one you gotta recommend me to, then. I wanna travel everywhere and meet lots and lots of people from all over the beehive. Look, Mama, they're so shiny! You stole those, Elise. Be honest. I didn't steal them, you... Settle down now, you two. More importantly, are you alright, my dear? Ah, uh, about earlier. I... There's no need to hold your tongue, Elise. The townsfolk made too much of it. That wasn't remotely acceptable. Everyone knows old Jockins lost his wits. Don't you start up, though. Oh, Mama, can I get shoes like that, too? You have ugly ogre feet, Groon. Well, that's not nice! Don't talk to your sister like that! Mama! Apple's being mean again! <laughs> Can't you two see I'm trying to talk to Elise? I am alright, Miss Lizbeth. Thank you. We can catch up later, Elise. I'd best go. I'd ought to have a word with you, Jen. My goats aren't doing so good. Oh no, the goats! Ogre feet! Ogre feet! Apple! <laughs> They're so cute, these kids. How's the game, by the way? I love it! And you know, not just because I'm in the game, but like the game itself just goes right up my alley. I love retro games. I love um, RPGs. I love romance. I love horror. And the general aesthetic is just so good. Now, hopefully, Flock stays okay as well. Oh, Elise, you scared me stiff earlier. I did? It takes a great deal of courage to put those two in their place. You did well, Elise. They're the ones being unreasonable. Mrs. Matilda. They'll be babbling on and on about it in church, I'd wager. Would you say they'd be wanting a word with me, Mrs. Matilda? They might, but you have nothing to fret about, Elise. I can assure you, not one soul in Kieferberg thinks ill of you, my dear. Except that maybe old Jockin. Thank you, Mrs. Matilda. Besides, the townsfolk are still shaken by that windstorm. I'd say they'll forget all about you and your shoes by the afternoon. Well, I wouldn't be so certain. Oh, boy. I guess? Wah! Freya! Hello? I was gonna say, I guess we can do some chores, but after this... My Elise! Look at those shoes! Red truly does look best on you, Elise. Why, thank you. Oh, you will have to wear them to the festival, Elise. Now is the time to find yourself a proper suitor, Elise. Ah, uh, 
That's precisely what we were just chatting about with Freya. Oh, yes. Aren't I a little too young to be looking for a husband? Why, the sooner the better, I'd say. That's not exactly what I'd like to be doing with my time, if I'm honest. Yeah, she'd rather be finding a girlfriend. <laughs> and yes, I have played Mad Father before. Second favorite now after Little Goody Two Shoes. Wah! I'm happy to know that you. I'm happy to know that you like it that much. And I've I've not finished Witch's House though. I do want to get back to it. And yes, sir, is right there. Kiss. Freya can be your husband. I used to feel the same way until I met Finn. You'll see. I'd say Freya's got a good chance of meeting her future husband soon. Oh. Oh, Mrs. Brunhilda, I wouldn't say I'm... You're quite the catch, isn't she, Dorothy? Oh, Freya is THE catch. I mean, thank you, but... Uh, in truth, I... I do feel the same as Elise. My interests lie elsewhere, you see? Oh, you don't mean... Uh, um, uh, sewing! Yeah! Totally not the gays. Totally. And I have my hands full with the festival, too. This really isn't the time. Oh, that reminds me. Would you come and meet me by the well today at dusk, Elise? Oh, uh, yeah, I suppose. Girls these days, huh? You two will come around, I'm certain. Yeah, I'll meet you at the well. Also, hi, Snaker. How you doing? Welcome in. How have you been? I've missed you. I don't think I'll be coming around anytime soon. Nope. Not with somebody else in your heart. What kind of chores she wants me to do? Okay, hold on. We should go around and talk to people before we take on any chores, because that's going to progress the time. Yeah, sewing, of course. Quote, unquote, sewing. Sewing as in, I'm so in love with Elise. <laughs> oh, boy. What a cute little house! Look at the cute little... Cute little heart window. Oh, this is Freya's house! It fits her so well. I've been told it was Freya's mother who decorated their home. Where's Freya's mom? I can see where Freya got her creativity from, I suppose. Oh, hello there. I don't even remember who used to live here. In its cozy nook, an old home waits to be consumed by the overgrowth. Oh, gosh. Hi there. Oh, how dreadful. Look what that windstorm did to our poor alleys. It did away with a few things, I see. You make too much of it, Elise. I don't know what else there is to say about the windstorm, Mrs. Odili. Um, love Phoebe's adult woman vice. <laughs> I'm glad you guys like it, Cosmic Cotton and Cyberpunk. I'm glad that it's very soothing to you as well. Hmm, that gives me some ideas for some, uh, some, like, roleplay voice videos I could post up on YouTube or, like, voice packs I could release. Hmm, -hmm. definitely let me know if there's anything like that that you guys want to see from me. Oh yeah, feel free to join the Discord server as well. I forgot to tell you guys that. Um, if you go to my website, or there might be a link in the... A description or something like that. You guys can join my Discord and you can get lots of news and then we could we do like watch parties together and stuff. Mm hmm Most of the townsfolk already put it behind them, so why can't you? Old Jockin's just as concerned as I am, lass. And for good reason. Oh, here we go again with old Jockin. Wow, why don't you go marry him then, Mrs. O'Dealy? Ah, that reminds me. I can assure you, Mrs. O'Dealy, these shoes aren't... Old Wilhelm's making a rosary for my precious granddaughter, G Gisella? Gisella? Gisella, you see? Won't you please go see if it's ready for me, Elise? I suppose. Oh, okay. Wow. Oh, is there anything back here? No. I like that I can go in. Ah, I see. I get to do fetch quests for people, too. Requests... 
haven't been present for a beehive watch party in so long. We're definitely gonna do a Macross Frontier movie watch party sometime soon. We definitely will. Yeah. I'm very, very happy and grateful that, like, all the characters that I've had the pleasure of voicing so far have been characters that I've fallen in love with. Entirely. Also, Tan Nose, thank you so much for the raid. I appreciate it. Welcome in, raiders. We are playing Little Goody Two Shoes right now. It is a new, lovely game that just came out that I actually got to voice act in, in both English and in Japanese. Um, and for those of you guys that are new here, hello. I'm Phoebe, your 2.5D fairy tale idol and voice actress that loves to write her own music in Japanese and in English. And sing it on both the IRL and the virtual stage. Eto. No, I've not done any voice work for Macross, but that would be a dream come true. Like, my dream role is doing the English... the official English voice for Ranka. If they ever made a... Macross Frontier English dub. But Tenmose, how was your, uh... How was your, um... Your stream? What did you guys do? Yes, I was playing Pocket Mirror to introduce my viewers to Astral Shift's works before moving on to Little Goody Two Shoes. Ah! Well, I hope that you guys have been having a wonderful time playing um, Pocket Mirror because that's how I became a fan of Astral Shift in the first place as well. Also, a wonderful game that you guys should check out. Definitely feels a lot more horror than this one does. Um, hi, Zero Master. Welcome in. Welcome in. It was nice today. I'm so glad. What did I voice act for? Oh, I voice act for acted for this game in Japanese and in English. Though, it's not fully voiced, so you get to hear it, like, during important parts, and, uh... You'll hear it during the date today. Mm hmm Yeah, see, the character that I am using as my PNG today? Um, that's the character that I got to voice. And we're going for her romance about this time. I'm here for my earful, I suppose. You're no child, Elise. For goodness sake. I'll spare you, Elise, as you're... You're aware you've said too much. I couldn't have stayed silent, you know that. I agree it was their fault, Elise, but... We both know this will only get you the wrong kind of attention. Old Jockins, to be exact. Well, who cares about Old Jockins' opinion? Imagine Seikan Hiko, Phoebe version. It's official, oh my gosh. That would make me so happy. I'm well aware, Lep Kuhen. There's no real need for you to fret over this, you know? There is the utmost need for me to fret over it, Elise. I'll keep Father Hans from dwell dwelling, bah, dwelling on it too much. All right. Why don't you meet me here at dusk, Elise? We could both use a little downtime, wouldn't you say? Ah, so they're specifically trying to make it so I can't romance both Leb Kuhen and Freya at the same time. Hmm? And yeah, Pocket Mirror doesn't have any romance in it. Also, uh, welcome home, Java. Welcome home. Was there kissing? Was there flirtation? There was no kissing, but there was flirtation. Mm. Jokin is pronounced yo Yokin? Ah, Yokin. I see. Thank you. Yokin. Yo Yok Yokin. I see. I'll try my best. <laughs> I'm not so certain I want to talk to these two. I'm hoping you've had some time to think, Elise. Kieferberg needs order and fellowship, Hans. It needs stability. We can't keep going like this. Going like what? You're well aware what I'm talking about, lass. Let's keep our cool, old Jokin. I mean, Jokin. Jokin, 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 Jokin. 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 With the extra spit. Mm. Elise has spared some thought, I'm certain. Let's say I have. You ought to listen to your elders, lass. I've been thinking about it and thinking about how you guys are dingai. Or, or sorry, dinguses. Lumpkin. Yeah, he's old Lumpkin. <sighs> nice eyelashes. <laughs> I guess in that case then... We can do some chores. Actually, is there anything else this way? Well, there's different kinds of chores. 
Let's see. Apples and chopping wood. Ooh, what a romantic place. How pretty is a little fish... fish fountain. Oh, this is where we're gonna meet Freya later on. How have I been? I've been well, thank you so much. I've been really, really busy lately. Um, I just finished my tour, so I'm relaxing a little bit more. But then right after the tour, I got super sick, so that was unfortunate. <laughs> um... Who to... which one should I... ooh! Another shop. Oh, I'm, I'm broke. Hold on. I need money. The washing well, not the wishing well. Oh, man! Okay. Let's see. Picking apples. Yeah, let's pick some apples. You can leave it to me, Mrs. Marlin. It's fine. Picking apples! Ah, enjoy your look at GG and Natural. Congrats on the part in the game, Phoebe. This game looks amazing and I plan to play it, so I don't want to get spoiled. Just wanted to wish everyone a happy stream. Thank you, Atrikia. I really appreciate it. Thank you for popping in. And, um, definitely. I understand if you don't want to spoil yourself. Well, yeah, Sylvie, and thank you for popping in. Raining apples! I can only get an S while playing with raining apples, so I aim for those when I can. Ah, uh, I see. Well, maybe then... Hopefully, I'll be the same. If not, then maybe you're just really, really good at raining apples. Careful, falling apples can hurt. True. What? I think those are plums. Or something I'm not supposed to... Why? Why? Why is there an anvil? No, no anvil! Why are anvils falling from the trees? Three, two, yeah, this theme is so good. Did. An A! Hmm. What if 150 was the cutoff? What if 150 was the S? What if I barely got there? What if... What if... What... What am I gonna... <sighs> I mean, an A is close, though. Try again. I'm broke, so unfortunately I cannot. If 150 was a cutoff, I'm gonna be so mad. I think I've seen someone get into 150 and still get an A. Yeah, at least it got an A, that's true. Well done, Elise. I can make all the pie I could ever want with these. Haven't you had a few too many sweets lately, Marlin? Here you go, my dear. Thank you, Mrs. Marlin. Yay! Money! 155 is an S. Ah! <laughs> Pain! A for foray. Uh ha. <laughs> Man, I'm so sad. Wait, <laughs> don't I never find you, Elise? For goodness sake. Oh, what now, Muffy? Oh wait, did I call her the right thing? I don't know. It, it's your Anyway. I don't have food. Well, actually, I do have food for her, but I don't have food for you. Shoo, shoo! <laughs> but at least it's your... My what? Your friend! Huh? The last with the funny hat! She's right outside! Huh? What? Ah! No! Why is she here? What the heck? Why did you come to town? Rosenmarine! 
My, you're covered in dirt, lass. Oh. She's so funny looking. Look at her silly hat. Yeah, it's a very witch-like hat too. Oh no. Angelica, don't be rude. Do you know this lass, Lizbeth? Uh, yeah, no. uh, Lee said she's from Primaldorf. Oh. Oh. I'm not from Primaldorf. I've never had... Uh, what? Don't do Hey! Hey! If I said it, then play along with it. Also, enjoy your lurk time, no say. Bye-bye. Why, I haven't the faintest idea, Ariane. Oh, I... uh, I'm... I'm looking for Elise. Have you seen her? Elise? Elise, do you know her? We do happen to know Elise, but how do you know her, lass? Oh no, on the same day where I got... Like, people got sussy of me because I waltzed into church singing. Uh... Well, Elise s said she she's adopted. When did you hear about all this, Melly? Nobody can get her name right. Oh my gosh. <laughs> well, if you'd please tell me where. Look, Mama, she's got a tiny scarecrow. Yeah, isn't it cute? She's got a little doll. Oh, but I... Oh, forgive me, but does anyone know where I can find Elise? Oh, boy. How did Muffy get here before we did? We were just together. Rosemarine! Rosemarine! What are you doing here, you? So you do know the last Elise. <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh yes, she's a uh, together, Elise. A <laughs> uh, distant cousin from Primaldorf. Why, you don't have cousins, Elise? I do recall Old Hall's mother had a sister, but I've never met her. Mm -hmm. Yes, exactly. Rosmarine here is my aunt's granddaughter. Oh, but I... Oh, oh it's Rosenmarine. Oh, I'm so very pleased to meet you, Rosenmarine. <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> Anyhow, it's getting quite late. We'd best move along before. Ah, uh, but do tell me, my dear. How long have you known you had a cousin? Oh... Boy, what am I gonna say? Also, hi, Wonder Waffle. Thank you so much. I've missed you. Stream is going really, really well. It's been fun. And thank you for the congratulations as well. How have you been? Uh... Granny Hall told me all about her. <laughs> she said Rosemarine here... Or Rosemarine here might show up one day, you see? I never got to meet my aunt before she passed, but I'm glad I got to meet my cousin. Ah, uh, I see, I see. And she turned up just in time for the festival, too. Mama, Mama! Can the funny lady come play with us? Of course. Uh, I wouldn't mind. I wouldn't want to bother you, Rosemarine. <laughs> Everybody can get her name right except for Elise. You all are very welcoming, but we ought to move along and... One wonders, Elise. How did you meet your cousin, then? Uh... Oh, God. Oh, what's less sussy? Uh... She sent someone... to Kieferberg. I found her all alone out at the crossroads. Uh... <laughs> Rosmarine asked someone from Primaldorf to ask around Kieferberg, you see? Ah, I see. I can't say I remember anything on the sword. I'm surprised such a thing didn't make itself known about town. How did you uh, mention? <laughs> you see, we... Oh, perhaps we're being rude, Ariane. I must say, I'm curious, too. <laughs> well, I'd love to sit and chat, but we don't have the time. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, of course, we, uh... We ought to sweep the living room. Ah. Oh! Don't try to lie if you're bad at it, Rosenmarine! <laughs> Truly a pleasure to meet you all. <laughs> oh, let's go, Rosemarine. Ah! I chose a bad... I chose a bad... I chose a bad choice. Oh... Oh, no... Rosemarine, what the heck? Why 
Why did you come out here? Why? For goodness sake! Have you completely lost your wits, Rosmarine? <sighs> I'm sorry, Elise. Huh? I knew you had a bird's nest for a brain, but this is too much. Hey, that's a little much, don't you think? It's kind of mean. Ugh, well... You know what you did. I'm sorry, Elise. I didn't mean to. I was chasing after your flock, you see? Oh my gosh, why? Why you gotta chase after your flock? Just let him come to town if he wants to. Also, I love you too, VTR. Thank you. Ah, uh, Yeah, F's in the chat. Or what the fudge? For goodness sake. For goodness sake, Rosemarine. Or Rosmarine. Why not let him frolic about? That's what goats do! That's what I was thinking, right? Oh. Let him be free. He took the laundry I was tending to right out of my hands. I couldn't let him ruin your sheets. Mm. All right, well... Truth is, we made a complete mess of it. Uh. I don't even want to think about Father Hans' reaction. Uh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to trouble you. Uh. Forget it, Rosmarine. It's all right. Honestly, I think that maintaining secrecy was more important than protecting my sheets, but thank you for trying to be considerate, I guess. <sighs> I'm telling you, it's fine, Rosmarine. I feel all I've done so far is trouble you. Uh, that's kind of true, but you're very sweet, so I can't blame you. Yeah, she had good intentions, at least. Which isn't a complete lie now, is it? Oh my god, so mean, though. Yet, I do enjoy your company, so... Wow! Such a tsundere. Anyhow, we ought to keep our stories straight. Maybe if we tell them I came to lend you a hand with work? This is it! That's it, Rosmarine! <sighs> Alright. Listen carefully. Your grandmother is Granny Hall's auntie. The one that never came to visit. That makes you my distant cousin of sorts, you see? Yes. You came about to meet me, but... We could have simply bumped into each other. And you asked me if I knew anyone named Hall. I'm sorry, I... I don't understand, Elise. How does that relate to what I said? <laughs> Why? You liked Kieferberg so much, you wanted to stay and lend a hand. Oh. You're a kind, charitable, loving soul who wants to help with the festival. That'll keep them from asking too many questions, I'd wager. <laughs> I think that's a great idea, Elise. All right. This being said, Rosmarine, you're going home right after nightfall, you hear? I don't want to hear you hanging about the... I don't want you hanging about these folks too much. Yes. All right, Elise. I did it! We're making it happen right now, then. Let's go! Yes. All right. Well, we're gonna try to be... the least sussy that we can be. Oh, party talk. We must be careful, Rosmarine. These folks are all noisy, not nosy and ill-tempered. We don't want to make this situation any worse, understood? Yes, Elise. I'll be good. You'll see. I know you will be good. You are a good girl. You are a very good girl. Hi. Well, I guess... We can, like... Take on some more work? Or something? I want to check out that other shop now that I have money. Ooh, what's this? What is that? Uh, play Kiss the Rat with the kids. Kiss the Rat! What the heck is Kiss the Rat? Goodness gracious, Elise. There's no need to make such a fuss, Freya. Oh, it's such a pleasure to meet you! My name is Freya. I'm a friend of Elise's here in Kieferberg. Oh, I'm, um... Oh, Rosenmarine. What a wonderful name, Rosenmarine. It's nice meeting you, Freya. Ah, uh, yes. 
My wives get to meet. She's my cousin, Freya. She's my cousin, Freya, from Primaldorf. From Primaldorf? Oh, you simply must come and dance with us. Uh, of course, Freya. Everyone keeps talking about this festival. And I'm very much looking forward to it. There is so much to show you. I can't wait. Oh, I know. Why don't you two come to dinner tonight? Come have dinner tonight. Yeah, let's do it. Tonight won't work, Freya. She's lending me a hand at home tidying up Granny Hall's old bits and pieces. Oh, that's... Quite all right. It's such a shame, though. I very much appreciate the invitation, Freya. Of course, you're welcome anytime. Tell me if you need anything, both of you. Don't work yourself into the ground now. You too, Elise. Oh, but I wanted to have dinner with my girlfriend. Or... Yeah. Hello? Pretty lady. How can I help you, darling? Oh my gosh. Oh, pretty, 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 pretty lady, pretty, 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 pretty lady, pretty lady, pretty lady. What's all this about? Grape juice, ointment, bandages. I guess we should grab some grape juice in case our sanity goes down. Um, that's about it. Do I have anything to sell? Oh no, I don't want to sell any of my bread. Okay, so I'm going to get to Freya's date. I'm gonna get to Freya's date at the end of this day. And then... After that, I'm probably gonna wrap up stream there. So, please look forward to Freya's date! But Miss Velma... Velma voice is on point. <laughs> Thank you, I'm so glad that you think so. Miley's, who is this lass? This is my cousin, Rosmarine. Rose and Marine. Oh, I could have sworn it was just you at Old Hall. She'd always said I had an auntie in Primaldorf. Rosmarine's that auntie's granddaughter. You're very welcome in Kieferberg, Rosmarine. You simply must stay for the festival. Of course. Oh, I'd best gather the laddies for class now. Oh, she the school teacher here? Hi, ECP! How have you been? I've missed you! It's going well. We're playing a game that I got to voice act in. You're a teacher, Miss Dorothy? Ah, uh, I teach them some basic reading, writing, and numbers is all. All right, Mrs. Dorothy. We'll be on our way now. It was a pleasure to meet you, Rosamarine. You too, Mrs. Dorothy. Oh, let's introduce... Oh god, old Jockin's talking to my dad. Papa, I have something to introduce you to. Now that is a face we've not seen before. Ah, uh, Mr. Gustav, this is my cousin, Rosmarine. I... It's Rosenmarine. A cousin? I had no idea you had family besides old, old Hall of these. I do recall Old Hall had an aunt someplace near Primaldorf. Welcome to Kieferberg, lass. I do hope you stay for the festival. Ah, uh, yes, I will. I must say, I'm rather taken aback, Elise. Not that much, a surprise, much of a surprise, is it? Rosmarine came to me after her grandmother passed, that's all. The lass is right, there's no reason to fret. Ah, uh, of course. I wouldn't want to make anyone feel... On the contrary, Rosmarine. It's the other way around, if anything. I'm certain you'll enjoy your stay, lass. Thank you so much. Aha! Suspicion down! That's good. Where are we at now? Only one suspicion. Okay, I do want to try playing Kiss the Rat. But... First, I feel like we need to go around talking to people. Oh! Wasn't I supposed to check in with some old guy about somebody's, uh... rosary as well? So, this is your cousin, Elise. Ah, it's a pleasure to meet you. I'm Rosenmarine. We were discussing the flower crowns for the festival, Elise. I ought to make one for Rosenmarine, too. Oh, I wouldn't want to trouble you. Don't be silly, Rosenmarine. We want you to feel welcome. Be done with that scruffy hat of yours, too. I was surprised to hear you had a cousin, Elise. Linda and Lisbeth here told me everything just now. 
Um, we still haven't introduced Rosin to Lab yet. <gasps> You're right, Cyberpunk! Also, thank you for the super chat. I appreciate it. I still don't quite understand how she came to cute to be in Kieferberg, though. Ah, uh, you see... I've always known I had an auntie named Hall in Kieferberg. I heard of the festival and decided to take my chances, all. Ah, uh, that truly is wonderful, lass. Oh, but what's an old, old Hall? Oh, would you look at the time! We are so busy! Oh, do enjoy the festival, dearie. Thank you. We're saved. Good thinking, Rosmarine. Gosh, why so sussy? Oh, thank you, VGR. Yeah, I can't wait to see the town when it's all decked out. Full of surprises today, aren't you, Elise? Oh no, this music makes me feel like they're gonna be real sussy. My, who's this lass? I'd like to introduce you to my cousin from Primal Dwarf. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm Rosenmarine. You don't mean to tell me Hall still has family in Primal Dwarf. She did, but... I wouldn't want to speak on Rosen Ros Rosmarine's behalf, but... Ah, my granny has already passed, so... I see. That's rather unfortunate. You're from a humble home, I can see that much. Oh, truly, I've always been rather... Why, aren't we all from humble homes, Mrs. Bertha? Truly, Bertha, we hardly know the lass. My, people take offense to everything these days. Yay! We're at zero suspicion now. Good. Oh, I need to find Muffy to give her that, uh... To give her the pretzel as well. Hi, Lab. Ah, uh, but who's this, Elise? That look on her face means trouble. I can tell. Oh, good day. This is my cousin, Rosmarine Lebkuhen. A cousin. My cousin. Yes. She's a distant cousin from Primal Dwarf, related to Granny Hall's auntie, you see? <sighs> oh no, she's so saucy! Why is she being so saucy of us? Is my lying that bad? No, no, no. Stick to the story, Elise. Keep it together. It's all in your head. Ah, I'm here for the festival. It's a pleasure to meet you, Rosmarine. I'm Lebkuhan. Oh, it's Rosenmarine, actually. I've fallen into the, into the habit of calling her Rosmarine. A habit. Oh, uh... Not a habit. I didn't mean to call it... Has Elise shown you about the town yet, Rosenmarine? Uh, not yet. I only got here on Saturday, and we've been at home mostly. Saturday. I did mean to introduce you two. I have no doubt, Elise. Oh my god, she knows! She can tell! I spend most of my time here, Rosenmarine. You know where to find me. Uh, thank you, Miss Lebkuhen. Oh, Lebkuhen is fine. Don't let Elise work you too hard, you hear? Very funny, Lev. Oh god. Freya and Lev are so opposites in some ways. Okay, let's save real quick here. Okay, uh... Forever Rosmarine. Wow, so I guess that means that she's... That Elise is self-aware. That she calls Rosmarine the wrong thing. That's messed up. Taking pity on beggars now, are you, Elise? There's no need to be so crude, Elma. This penny beggar, Mrs. Elma, happens to be my cousin. Ah, would you look at that? A cousin! I don't recall Hall ever ha having siblings, Elise. Of course she didn't. Can't you see the poor lass has lost her wits? What? You're being rather unreasonable, Mrs. Elma! Huh? Giving Kieferberg such a bad reputation. Why, you. Truly, Elma. I must say, that's no way to welcome Elise's cousin. Uh, I'm sorry. You have been a bother. Yeah, Elma, worst girl, honestly. Not at all, lass. I apologize for this altercation. F allow me to introduce you. This is my cousin, Rosmarine. Rosenmarine. Alright, I'll acknowledge that was rather unfortunate of me. Welcome to Kieferberg, Rosenmarine. Thank you. There. Now I have negative suspicion. 
Ah, contender for worst girl. I see. I see. <laughs> What's up here? Oh, how dreadful. You're making a bigger deal out of this than you ought to, old Odili. What now? Odili here caught wind of your cousin, Elise. Heard you're from Primaldorf laughs. Ah, yes, from a nearby village in truth. And your... She's the granddaughter of Granny Hall's auntie, Mrs. Odili. You've heard of her, I'm certain. I suppose. Old Hall did spend quite some time in Primaldorf, from what I recall. I know, it really does make the town feel alive. And everybody's got their own, uh... Their own... Personality? That's what I've been trying to tell you. I must say, I'm still trying to figure out exactly how you two met, Elise. We met by chance. Ah, well, that's quite different from what you... Rosamond Reen's granny told me about her long ago, you see? Yes, I came here in hopes of finding my relatives. We bumped into each other by the crossroads last Saturday. She asked me if I knew of someone named Hall. Now that's a story worth telling, lass. Ah, I see. Did you hear that, old Odili? There is no need to fret. All right, well... Welcome to Kieferberg, I suppose. Thank you. It's a pleasure to be here. Oh. Ah, uh, they're being... They, they, they suspect me. They suspect me. Oh, there's Finn. There's the famed cousin. We heard all about her from Ariane. Allow me to introduce you. Mr. Finn, Mr. Guido, this is my cousin, Rosmarine. Ah, it's a pleasure to meet you. She didn't correct us this time. Just in time for the festival, aren't you, lass? Oh, I've been hearing all about it. Make certain you make most of it while you're here. Rosmarine's going to be helping me with work all week. Making your cousin work for her stay, Elise? Doesn't surprise you in the least, does it? No, Elise is very kind. It was a joke, lass. Oh... You're very welcome in Kieferberg, Rosmarine. It's Rosmarine. It's time we go, Rosmarine. We have much to do. <laughs> oh no, everyone else is going to be calling her Rosmarine too. Gotta sleep early for your certification exam. Have a good night and fun on have fun on your stream. Oh, thank you. Good luck with your certification exams, Liddy. Best of luck to you. Okay, we're gonna go play Kiss the Rat. And then, we're gonna go romance Frey. Hi, Nemo! How you doing? Welcome in! Okay... Yeah, Lise is infecting, infecting the townsfolk now. Hi! I can't find the guy that we were supposed to talk to about the rosary, but whatever, we'll find him later. First the rat, then the riz. Is it... Oh, it's afternoon now, yeah. Kiss the rat! So you were lying, Melly. I, I told you! I know what I saw. Wait, they even they... Even the other kids call Muffy the wrong name! <laughs> I love that. What did you two tell... <laughs> what did you tell these two, Melissa? Uh, maybe it's best we don't annoy her, Elise. You shush it, Rosmarine. Oh, won't you and your cousin play Kiss the Rat with us, Elise? Do we get money from Kiss the Rat? We can play with you, I suppose. Oh, a game? You stay close to me, Rosmarine. I'll go call Groon. What the heck is this? <laughs> what is this game? Ah, take care, Ruby. Thank you so much. We'll be wrapping up soon anyway. So the VOD will definitely be there for you to watch on YouTube afterwards. Thank you so much for being here, and it was lovely meeting you. See you next Friday, hopefully. Kiss the rat! D is blue pass, X is yellow pass. I see. Blue, yellow, blue, yellow. Oi! Ah! Ah! No! No! Oh shoot, I suck! Oh! Oh my god! Oh! 
Oh no! games were. Hey, I gotta practice my smooching. What the heck? I pressed it! Oh my gosh. No, no! Oh, my gosh. I sucked so bad. <sighs> oh, D! Good job. No, not good job. <sighs> almost double digits. Not even almost double digits. Yes, I'm trying again. Kind of jealous, not gonna lie. Of... Of me? Or the rat? Oh. oh, I see you gotta do it a little early. No! This is hard! Ah! Ah! I forget which one's blue, which one's yellow! Okay, good. What? What? Ah! Ah! Rosamarine didn't help me with this at all. Game is impossible. I can see why. Oh, oh I, this is such a sweaty game. Cyberpunk. <sighs> what do I do? What do you guys want me to do? You want me to try again? Or <laughs> what do I do? A. You want me to get a uh, B for brutal? What I did during my playthrough was to save before work so I could keep trying to get an S. That's true. I did save. I did save earlier before Kiss the Rat. Well, I passed. 
It's a tie, huh? Boom left already, but you can have this, Elise. It's from the two of us. What did you give me? Oh, money. Hooray. I stole a kid's allowance. <laughs> I'll get better. I'll get an A or an S next time. Maybe not an S, but... Yeah, we, we, we got better and better, didn't we? It's best you head on home now, M Rosmarine. Folks have had enough of you for one... That's so mean! Why is she so mean? <laughs> oh, it was so much fun, Elise. You say so. I'll see you at home, then. Well, to be fair, we didn't really work today. We just played Kiss the Rat. A B is still 32 Tiffle. Oh... Well... Oh yeah, it's time to go romance Freya. Okay, this is gonna be the last thing we do for the day. <laughs> oh, money. <laughs> Here we are. Hi. There she is. Spend some time with her. She is exuding hearts. Oh, it's wonderful! Oh, Elise, they're wonderful! <laughs> they suit me rather well, don't they? Oh, the shoes? Oh! Feed Muffy! Or your sus will go up. Well, I can find her at night, right? Maybe? They suit me rather well, don't they? Your legs are so long. It's like you were made for those shoes. Or the shoes were made for you, maybe? <laughs> You're exaggerating, Freya. <laughs> Nothing of the sort, Elise. You're so elegant. Huh? <sighs> How pretty. I always thought you were so graceful, even when we were younger. <laughs> Freya! I'm more of a farmland lass, you see? <laughs> Made to chop wood and draw water from the well. You know, I... I wouldn't put it like that, Freya. Oh, she has confidence issues. You're different, Elise. You're so confident and poised. Not one of those folks would ever agree with you, Freya. You always know when to stand your ground and what to say. Which is what gets me in trouble to begin with. Like today. I can't help but admire the way you carry yourself, Elise. Freya... You're truly... <sighs> How I wish I were as brave as you are. Huh? I could never talk back to Mrs. Wilma, or to anyone else for that matter. You are a little too forgiving, that's true. Aw, oh, Freya just like me for real, for real. That's why they keep praising me left and right, I suppose. Actually, Freya is being really, really... relatable to me right now. <laughs> oh no! They turned me into a game character. What's keeping you from speaking your mind, Freya? <laughs> oh, I'm too much of a chicken for that, Elise. Hmm. These both don't sound good. These both don't sound good. Hmm. If we say she'll never change, I feel like that would make her really sad. Cause she wants to change, you know? This kind of sounds like Elise just being like... Typical tsundere Elise but means well, you know? Hmm... The new Freya was the perfect character for you. <laughs> I'm really happy that you think so. Or that they thought so. Yeah, I feel like it's... Oh, I feel like it's this right one, maybe? What we saved before? And I mean, if we mess up, that means we're gonna go back and redo Kiss the Rat, so... This is ridiculous! Oh my god. Oh, she's mad at me, what? You've lost your wits! And it's only Monday! <laughs> huh? huh? Who's 
to tell you what you can or cannot do. <laughs> uh, it's not as though I can simply start... Only it truly is that simple, Freya. Elise. You're so capable and gifted. I know how much you love this town, but... Even you have to admit, all it does is hold folks back. I know, Elise. Yet I can't seem to get to the bottom of it. Kieferberg is my home, after all. It's not as though you can't build a home someplace else, Freya. So if I do, will you build that home with me, Elise? <laughs> I know, but... This is where my father is. Where you are. It's... It's where my memories of my mother are, too. Oh, my mom is dead! Oh... Freya... I've thought about Primal Dwarf, or even going beyond that, but... I must say, I'm glad to be here in this moment. Right where I am. Elise... With you, in Kieferberg. You, Elise? You do make it more bearable, I suppose. <laughs> yes, yes, I do, don't I? Pray. Pray is so. She's so happy. I'm so happy. <laughs> Kieferberg wouldn't be the same. Me <laughs> Sorry, I'm so happy. Kieferberg wouldn't be the same to me without you, if I'm honest. Freya. You're truly. Capable and gifted. I heard you the first time, Elise. <laughs> she did call me that. <laughs> Freya? Why, you? Say, I'll be home all afternoon tomorrow. I'll be there. Wow! We didn't even finish asking her. And she already... I feel like something is blooming. Something is truly blooming right now. Lilies. A field of lilies are blooming right now. <laughs> For goodness sake. Ah! Okay, so we did do the right choice! Thank goodness! I had a feeling. You know what? I'm probably gonna get all the answers right just because I know Freya that well. Because I am Freya. Last thing we gotta do. Hey! Wah! I thought that I I thought that I could feed. I thought that I could feed Muffy. I thought I could feed Muffy at night too, cause she was she was out at night. Last I checked. Uh... Darn it, Muffin. Ah, uh, now I know. Well. All that said... It is about time... ...that we wrapped up... ...this chapter of our adventure, just for today. Thank you guys so much for joining me... ...on part one... ...of our weekly playthrough... ...of Freya's Route in Little Goody Two Shoes. And I really, really hope that you guys have been enjoying... ...all the voice acting and stuff as well. Freya's fun to voice act as, of course, for obvious reasons, but I hope that I've been able to be a convincing, uh, you know, Elise and Lip Kuhan and, and Rosin Marine and everybody else. Mm. <laughs> Thank you so much, Athesis, for the super chat. Thanks for the stream, Phoebe. Gotta say, Freya is one heck of a catch. I mean, have you heard her voice? Truly magical. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Your voice is a gift? <laughs> Wait, you're making me... You're gonna make me cry. You're really gonna make me cry. Thank you. I'm really glad that you had a great time. I'll be doing this every Friday at the same time. 5 p.m. Pacific time, 8 p.m. Eastern on Fridays. Until we finish Freya's route. And then if there's enough interest, we can do some of the other routes as well. Um, but they are being co-streamed on YouTube and on Twitch. 
thank you everybody on both Twitch and on YouTube for all of your support. I really appreciate it. Thank you for all the super chats, you guys. Thank you for all of the gifted subs and thank you for <laughs> just being here and spending time with me. It really means a lot. Really, really means a lot. Am I streaming tomorrow? I will not be streaming tomorrow because um, tomorrow is the rehearsal for my friend's wedding. So this weekend, I'm going to be really, really busy um, doing doing uh, stuff for my friend's wedding. But I will be back to streams next weekend as well. Mm -hmm. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Freya has two endings. Well, we're going to try to get the good one. We're going to try to get the good one. <laughs> I, I can imagine what the two options are. Coffee time, thank you so much for the super as well. I really appreciate it. Wow, it's your very, very first super chat on the live stream as well. Thank you. It means a lot to me. And I will look into opening up YouTube memberships as well. Um, and doing more YouTube exclusive content. So please keep an eye out for that. Um, I guess... If you're curious what it would sound like to, ha to listen to Freya singing... I do have a bunch of my own original songs as well as covers on my YouTube channel. So please do feel free to go check those out. I would say Fairy Tale is the closest thing to a Freya image song right now. So um, please feel free to check those out if you would like to. And they're also streaming on Spotify. Everybody, it's been really wonderful. It's been truly magical coming back to streaming weekly again. Um. Truth be told, I've been so busy with a lot of different things. Not just with the tour that I've been on the past year, but um, no, not Fairy Tale the anime. I wrote a song called Fairy Tale, and it's on my YouTube channel. Mm -hmm. Um, but um, not just with the tour, but with so many things. My life has kind of turned upside down in the course of just a year. But 2023 has truly been one of my favorite years of my life. If not my favorite, I think... Actually, I think this has been my favorite year of my life so far. And hopefully it only gets better and better from here on out. <laughs> so, thank you so much, you guys. Also, Kira Kira, thank you so much. That's really, really kind of you. Mm -hmm. Um, all of these VODs will be archived on YouTube. So feel free to go back and watch what you missed. I'll see you guys next Friday. And please keep an eye out for... More idol and voice acting stuff really, really soon. Thank you so much, Astral Shift, for giving me the chance to play Freya and bring her to life. I love her so much. Thank you, Square Enix and Square Enix Collective. And thank you very, very much to my mentor and my senpai, Diana Garnett, who is also the official voice of Elise, for believing in me so much. Yeah, thank you guys. I love you all very, very much from the bottom of my heart. Oh, yeah, Sylvie. And I guess I guess I'll find people to raid into on both the YouTube and the Twitch side. Wow, very first time co streaming. It was it was a lot. <laughs> Eto, um, yes. Have a good night, you guys. Please have a wonderful, wonderful weekend as well. Um, on YouTube, we're going to probably redirect into. Hmm... Ah! Let's redirect into... Obake Pam? Pam is a dear friend of mine, so... And she's playing Reverse 1 1999, which I've been really wanting to check out, so... Um... Let's... Oh, I don't mind suggestions. I don't mind suggestions, but I am going to prioritize people that are on my own list of mutuals. Not mutuals, but people I'm following first. <clears throat> I'm gonna... Oh, and then I'm gonna raid into Julie on the Twitch side. Because I've missed Julie a lot. There you go. Thank you so much, everybody, and I will see you next time. Oyasubi! Bye-bye!